<laughs> you wouldn't want to. Yeah. Put it in your kit for a new vehicle. Ooh. So you can keep it on your vehicle. Hello. Hollering for me? No, we don't. This looks pretty nice. 13 minutes to auction time. Hey everybody. Okay, Carl. Hey, Merle. We'll get it. Uh, Charles was trying to get caught up on invoices today where they was going to Cincinnati. He'll get the rest of them caught up tomorrow. Carl Click says she's got a invoice for oh. wristlet. Okay. Yeah, I'll we'll get, get it. We'll get it tomorrow. I get it, Carl. I've been I've been in the bed all day with my back in, so uh, didn't get a lot done as far as uh, paperwork and stuff like that. Hopefully, I'll feel better tomorrow, and we'll get get that done tomorrow. Uh, where'd this little box come from here? I don't know. Oh, somebody got it out when we sell that stuff and it's not that uh, crosses and stuff. Want me to sell it tonight? Yeah. The more oh, yeah, I won't sell it all together. <laughs> Yeah, if I can clean up this stuff tonight here, get that off the tables and clean up a lot of the tables. I didn't have no better glassware. That's what I was wanting to bring back. Didn't I? Yeah. Some of the crops and stuff. I got to resell that tonight. What? Oh, that uh, crop. Mark said he didn't want it. Hey everybody. Yeah, I may have to Charles uh be leaving a little early tonight. He may have to do a little auctioneering for us and then get Ricky in here a little bit. Uh -huh. I may have to sit down and just watch and enjoy. Watch it. We sell it for cheap, then he jumps up. Yeah, they, they <laughs> sell it for cheap, then I'm jumping up. We got any two leaders over there? No. I'm waiting for them to get my truck cleaned out so I can go. I'll make sure ain't nothing inside of it either. I didn't do that. Or anything like that. Yeah, I didn't pull hey, What about them prints that was under the seat? Where they at? In the truck. Are they in that one or they're in the front of the truck? There are prints in behind the seat that Joseph and a bunch of good prints. He told me they was under the seat or behind the seat. You know what he's talking about, Ricky? No, I heard him saying stuff about prints, but I don't know what they done with. I'm gonna set that down right there. See that right there? You hurt my back lifting that. Hey, Lucy. Why does it look dark in here? Am I going toward the upper room? Oh. I, don't know I thought I might be going towards your upper room. It's right up there. Or hang in. Where's Katie at? She's in the house. Petting on Mama Katie. You know there ain't no school the rest of the week. And you know there's none Monday either. Yeah, it was a professional day already. Most of the time your kids don't tell you. Oh, only one calls you. She's sitting right over there. That's Margaret. I'm oh, I Lucy. thought you said Lucy. I'm Mark. She's Margaret. Oh. I'm Lucy. Yeah, not my truck. 
Yeah, supposed to have some sun tomorrow. Had a little sun this afternoon, what I seen of it. Eight minutes to auction time, guys. We're going to have a lot of fun tonight. What was that? Where's that barrel at? I don't see that barrel. Black barrel. Oh, my I got worried. I was like, no, I'm all stay. I I think it's hot out here. That one in the middle is good. Yeah. That one in the middle, it's probably got a lot of stuff in the middle. Yeah, we go to the right above it. It's a very big one. Big old, big old, big old, big old, big old, big old. No, if uh, y'all bring me some stuff back, that way we won't have to have that much room over there. Yeah. Some good stuff, better stuff. Boxes of okay, good glassware. <laughs> you know what kind of stuff, the collectible stuff. <laughs> and if it's trash, just leave it on there and we'll toss it off over here. Six minutes to auction time, guys. We've got another slot machine tonight, guys, and it works. <laughs> Yeah, Gail, uh, they were just showing me that. They look beautiful. Uh, a lot of times the things that the camera don't, don't do things justice, and then when you see them in person, it's just uh, uh, amazing. Uh, Meeman put a picture of his leg lamp he got for his man cave, and I think he put a red red light in it or the the shade was red i don't remember but it was it looked really good in his man cave but tonight guys what we got lined up yes bubble gum machine yeah go ahead and push that door too guys uh we do got we got bubble gum machines we got another slot machine and it works good it works off of quarters uh we got uh a whiskey barrel a big tall whiskey barrel yeah, I tried to tell her that, and she just keeps pulling it up in that bun. <laughs> She's not listening to me right now, so I can talk about her. Uh, Bruce said hi, Charles. Thank you, Drew. I always look pretty decent myself, don't I? But we're going to start in five minutes. Oh, I was trying to, <coughs> we've got a, a camping, uh, the Coleman uh, stoves, uh, Kathy wants to talk to more you. nice. Uh, I've got four minutes before I go live. Tell her she ought to just tell you. Well, she wants to talk to you. Well, I tried to get a call me an hour ago. I can't talk two minutes for the auction time. She says four minutes. You don't fall over on that. Yeah. Okay. Howard, India. All right, David said he's here as long as his Oreos hold up. Howard, India. I shouldn't be. <sighs> Guys, we gave away $140 last night. Uh, what she say she want me to do with that, Mama? That's what she want to talk to you about, honey. Well, she explained it in there, so yeah. she said whatever I decided. Gave away $140 last night in cash, so you guys stick around. No telling what we're going to give away tonight. It's a really good auction last night. Had a lot of fun. You guys share. There will be some money given away on the shares, on your names. And then also tonight, we'll give away more money on the items. So any item that you buy tonight, whether it's a $2 and a half item or a $100 item, could be the winner tonight. 
uh, that that happens at the end of the auction. So uh, keep that in mind uh, if you want to be in that particular drawing. It don't cost you nothing to be in the other one. Uh, and then, then of course, you share. You get your name in there extra times. But uh, the one that we give away, uh, like we gave away the $100 bill last night. Some of you left early. We gave away a $100 bill. Uh, and uh, tonight, we don't know what it is. We'll let you guys know toward the end of the auction. And that was uh, on, a, on a basketball card is what that item was. So we put all the numbers in from one to it's 120 items. We put one through 120. And then we draw one of those numbers, and that, whoever bought that particular item wins the money. So we'll just enjoy James and keep them trolls away. Somebody said hi, Mother. I guess they're talking to somebody in the comments. Ansley wants you to. Uh, Who? Ansley. She says she wants you to put her winnings towards her bill. Who? Ansley. Ansley. <coughs> yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, Angela, I don't know if she's on here yet. There yeah, she, she is. Yeah, we'll do that. That way we don't have to send no cash in the mail. I mean, if there's any difference, we'll send it. But we've been in bed all day with her back, and uh, like I said, we didn't get any of the uh, – I'm sort of waiting on shipping to, uh, to get a you know good shipment for you guys that we have to ship to. I uh, want to welcome Lynn. I don't know if she's watching yet up in Canada. Uh, she won some items last night. She's going to be buying some smaller items, and we'll be sending them out all together. So you guys, uh, Lou and uh, some of the other guys, uh, uh, I talked to one today, Ben, I think. Uh, we'll get y'all's uh, invoices through PayPal. Maybe I'll feel better tomorrow and be able to get that done. Uh, you'll buy some tonight. Uh, yeah, Ricardo's another one. Y'all buy some tonight. We'll get it all together tomorrow. I ain't kidding. I've been in bed all day long today. Laying on a heating pad. Yeah, there she is. Uh, we got any two liters in the house, Ma? Uh, <clears throat> you see this other slot machine? The other one's got a little one doesn't work. Uh, the, this one here doesn't try. It's got a little change thing. It lights up. It lights up. This one actually works. Really good. Seven o'clock. Church bells ringing. Seven o'clock. Six o'clock. <laughs> Six o'clock. Well, the bells are going. It's been a long day, Jerry. That's a camera too, Jerry. Yeah. Uh, you can get any more help so we'll get tonight. You got some costumes there, maybe. Yes, sir. Well, uh, they're going to leave and do the names and everything. You got the Christy Bates and the Dutch Mop out. And then you can just have to run in here. Keeping on Mama Kitty. Oh, oh she's going to be you said All right, Ricky, I guess we're ready to get started. You guys ready to get started tonight? Yeah, if anybody needs any delivering done, because we are going to try to move some of the furniture tonight, probably a lot more tomorrow night. Uh, so, uh, you, uh, I've lost my train of thought. What was I going to say, Ricky? I don't know, Gary. I lost I my train of thought. It's gone. It's gone. Uh, if they need delivery done. Oh, Ricardo. Hey, I've looked at some of them in Texas. And almost bought one out there one time, and it was like going to be a nine, ten hour drive, and I changed my mind. It's too expensive that far away. The farthest we went, Randy said, sell nice quick. All right, we'll, we'll get to going, guys. I'm Jerry Whitney. Uh, they'll put my license number up there for my auctioneer license and my auction house license. Amanda, one of them, I'll put that up there. So, you guys, if you want to check on that, you're welcome to. Uh, I just want everybody, the new, especially the new people, to feel safe and know that uh, we'll treat you right and uh, get your items to you. And uh, we won't try to misrepresent anything. Uh, and if we don't plug something in, you know, like vacuum cleaners, microwaves or something like that, uh, if they don't work, we don't make anybody pay. And, of course, we uh, will tell you if it's shippable or not. 
and you you be the judge of that some things we can but if you get a, a item at a real good bargain and then it costs you so much to ship it it sort of negates uh the good bargain that you got it at so we try to work with you guys and somebody keep me up with a score on the lsu and uk game and also the louisville and the duke game uh if y'all don't care every once in a while pop that score up there uh, and go big blue all right guys we're ready to get started and uh, i ain't even got to thought think nothing about the lineup tonight so it's going to be helter skelter we're just going to be throwing items up here and trying to move items the best we can tonight we have got first item up tonight and i've not even opened these up to see if they're all in there yep coleman Capping time will be right around the corner, won't it, guys? Yep. We've got a Coleman uh, little cooking uh, deal right here. Hello, Diane Mahaney. Thanks for sharing. Everybody else that shared. And we're going to sell this first thing tonight. We've got a couple of these. Uh, I'll at least see one more down there. Uh, this one right here. Like I said, if you're going out camping and stuff, this ain't a new one. It is. It is used. It's an older one, and they always make stuff better in the older days. Yep. So somebody give me about ten dollars on that. <laughs> I mean, that's good about camping, and even if you're like grilling outside or something, you don't want to heat up the kitchen in hot that's summer. Good to take fishing, you? Yeah, well, you could cook your beans and stuff on that too outside if you was grilling and you know, or heat up, you know, whatever you needed to do on that, not heat the whole kitchen up. All right, guys, let's get her started. Somebody give me ten dollars on it. This could be the winning item tonight. Remember that. On the Coleman uh, cooking uh, stove here. Somebody give me 10 and let's go. $10 be able to go 10. $10 be able to go 10. $10 be able to go 10. $10 be able to go 10 on the Coleman cooking stove. Where y'all want to start at? Cook's good during disasters, right? Your electricity goes off, something like that. Give me $5 on it. I don't care, guys. This is y'all's auction. I want you to remember that. This is not my auction. This is y'all's auction, okay? I control it, and I do the rules and everything like that. But when it comes to bidding, guys, it's up to you. And I've got a $5 start bid from Edna Brown. $5 bid. Ricky, would you hit that light over there, please? Who's it at, Jerry? Uh, up on the, the tall wall there next to that triangle sign. See it, Ricky, next to the triangle. I got seven fifty from Wendell. Wendell, I got to meet your son the other day. You ought to be proud of yourself. He's a mighty nice young man, just... He's just polite as he can be, and I don't know if he's watching now. We'll give him the big head, but I want to throw kudos out to you. You raised a, a nice young fella right there. Yeah, I can remember that ice storm then. I got 10 from Lisa Marie Edwards there, and that's a Merle Blankenship Jr., I think. Yeah, I got him. Is who that is. <laughs> and guys, we've got our phone. Uh, it's charged, I think, out here, and everything's going good on it. Uh, and I need 12 and a half on the Coleman cooking stove. And I got it. Twelve and a half, fifteen. Twelve and a half dollar bill. Would you go fifteen? Twelve and a half. Would you go fifteen? Twelve and a half. Better late than never. Gail's here. Oh, there's Brandon. He is watching. I didn't want to give you the big head, Brandon. But you deserve it. You a nice, you a nice young man. I got twelve fifty, fifteen. Twelve fifty, go fifteen. Sold it to Edna Brown. Twelve fifty. Goodbye there, Edna. I hope you're feeling better too, Edna. Edna's been having back trouble, I think, too. Guys, we sold one of these last night. We're going to sell the other tonight. It was sort of late. This is for all your compartments. Holds all your little nuts and bolts and screws for your garage. Or you can put your little sewing notions in there. Really, it's just a nice little storage uh, bin here. You can hang it up in your garage, set it up. It's got, uh, I think there's one tray missing that I can see. One plastic tray missing. Somebody give me about 10 on that and let's go. Ten dollar bill, would you go ten? I'm gonna move my table if y'all don't care. That put a little more light on the situation. Uh, there is some nuts and uh, wire wire nuts and screws and a few little bolts and nuts like that and some screws uh, in that one. Uh, little nuts and screws. It's what I see in there. Maybe some Carter keys. Yeah, it's got a few little things in it. And I've got a $5 all over the house. And I won't be as wild tonight because, I, like I said, I don't feel real good. But we're going to get her done. I got five from Randy Maynard first, guys. And I want to remind everybody that, uh, like right now, Randy Maynard bid first. And it may show up on David's or Lisa's that they bid first. And I've got to go by what's on my screen, okay? 
I wouldn't do you wrong for nothing. I got 750 from Stephanie Walker. 750, would you go 10? And Ricky's going to be helping me some tonight. We're trying to get the U Hauls unloaded uh, for the rest of this week's sale. It's just going to be some, like I said, I, there's a whiskey barrel they brought in a while ago that's out of this it's world. Nice. It is nice. You know the ones you see over at the liquor store that they try to sell two, three hundred dollars, yeah. and this is an actual real one here. I've got ten from Diane Culberson, and we may be a little shy on glassware tonight. If you if you you're liking glassware, uh, I know there's a bunch of boxes of it, and uh, we may be a little shy on that tonight. But uh, one night this week we'll have a lot of it. Yes, Martha, it is staying dry. Uh, big kudos to John Carter, William Thomason. Uh, they came up there on a twelve fifty. What, what was that Debbie said? Damn it. Oh, about the glassware. Uh, now they're going to bring me. They're unloading the truck now. They're going to bring me some uh, boxes of glassware back in. So hopefully there'll be some fitting and some good pieces, Debbie. Okay, we do have some, but we don't have a lot of it. It's, I'm talking about the good stuff. That you guys like and i know what you guys like i got 15 from diana so uh and I, i'm expecting some more fenton some carnival glass and some good pieces all right sold to diane culberson 15 dollars ricky we're gonna sell an oil lamp now we do have some glass one now guys this thing here the the clips on it needs to be re uh re tightened up Everybody, i don't even know how to do that you put them up in there and they go through them slots and all while y'all bidding on it i'll just work on it and try to do that right now they go up in these slots and then they just bend down but it's a nice lamp it's got the shade and everything it's got the nice design on the bottom there it's amber and this one actually is an older one see how it screws in the older, uh, the newer ones that screw around the top. This is an older one that screws in. It's amber and it's in great shape. Like I said, this top thing here, it can be fixed. Yeah, it's it just the slots came out of it. I looked at it. I'll just put it there like that. But it's easy. You just got to take and bend those clips and everything back in. Well, the old lamp people, they know that. Uh, a name on the knob. Uh, it's probably Aladdin. I, I don't take me to that, so I'm gonna look. Well, I need my light at it's one. It's right up behind you, Jerry. Right over yonder. And I'm at eight dollars with Sandy Boardman. It says Farms Lamplight. Farms Lamplight on that right there like i said it's a nice one see there the the design on it and it screws down in the top and right now i'm with sandy borman yeah that's all you got to do randy and all the clips are there i'm at eight dollars and like i said this is an old one it's not one of the new ones this screws down inside there for those of you that uh, that knows lamps, you know that. And for those of you who don't, you learn something. I'm at eight, nine, eight dollar bill to go nine. Eight dollar bill to go nine. Eight dollar bill to go nine. Yeah. I got nine, ten. Nine dollar bill to go ten. I got nine, ten. Sandy, you're out. I got nine, ten. I got nine. Did you count Randy's bid or was you bidding, Teresa? Oh. I meant Leanne. Randy, Leanne bid nine. Give me ten, buddy. Well, Sandy's done gave me 10, they 12 and a half. That thing will bring 15, 20 dollars easy on any given day. It is an over. I'm in training. You've been training, Ricky. Ricky's in training. <laughs> got 10, 12 and a half, 10 dollars. Would you go 12 and a half? I got 12 and a half from Randy. 12 and a half, would you go 15? 12 and a half, would you go 15? I got 12 and a half, would you go 15? 12 and a half, would you go 15? Sold them out to Randy Maynard, $12 and a half. Sold them out $12 and a half. Nice buy right there. Guys, I've got a crackle vase. It's got nice colors in it and everything. See how it crackles? Pretty nice older piece right there. It's not real heavy. Nice piece there. Somebody set her in. 
about five dollars on this nice crackle vase. It's in good shape, no chips or anything. It's got your blue on the bottom, dark green there, then it goes up to a light green. Oh, we done sold it, Sandy. I'll have some more lamps. So I think there are some more lamps on there. You'll get a chance to win. Sorry about that. Yeah, I think it was. Do what? I think there were more lamps. Y'all set it anywhere you want to. Five dollars, two and a half, two and a half is the minimum bid. Then we go to three. Then it's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollar increments. And then we go to two and a half increments after that. And then we get up in the $50, 50 range, stuff like that. Sometimes I'll say the minimum uh, bid increment is $5 once we get on up high. That way it keeps the auction moving. On that nice vase right there, I'm going to throw in this right here with it too. This is a, you put it in your bathroom and it's a, I guess you, it's for a, it's good for soap. It may be for vinegar. Like a soap dispenser. Soap dispenser. Mm, that's for your kitchen, ain't it? Is it a corn? Yeah, it's corn. Where you put in it? Soap. Oh, you can put soap in it there, I guess. Yeah. And I got two and a half from Twala Martin on both those pieces. Yeah, olive oil, they said. That's what you put in it, olive oil. That's a nice piece. It's not, now this is not Shawnee or anything like that. There's the, uh, the name on the bottom. And I got two and a half from uh, Twala Martin. And we sold both of them nice pieces of Twala. Goodbye right there. Wouldn't that be funny now? Uh, Wendell, we already had Twala in at two fifty, dollars and I done sold them. Now, we've got uh, these little soup uh, bowls right here. They're not super old. Uh, probably 1970s, early 80s. I've got four of these little, I guess you would call them soup bowls. Got four of them. Let's go ahead and sell them, get them going and out of here. What? What's that woman's name had the next surgery? Well, she was looking at them today. I hope Melissa's watching. She's on here. I got five from Wendell Keith on all four of these. Like I said, these are not super old. They're made of a, a clay. Uh, they are microwave safe. And I guess they're a little, you could use them for different things to put different uh, $6. stuff in them. I got six from Kathy. I got seven and a half from Lisa Payne. And we are going to have some tools tonight. I got a, did y'all ever find out a estimate on that art roll? We didn't look up the stand or nothing. <laughs> Them helmets are high too. A mask. I got seven and a half from Lisa Payne and we're going to sell them to Lisa Payne right now. And I want to make a, tell you real quick, uh, the items, you know, we, we gave away a hundred dollar bill last night and a lot of you don't realize this. Some of you do, John, we done, you're behind John. We done sold them Lisa Payne for seven fifty. Uh, the night, the number of item that I drawed last night was this right here. It was number 98 and it was a Devin Booker card and it was won by my sister, Kathy Gillock. And usually we don't let our family win like that, but, uh, she, she was buying and paying and I didn't want to say it right on there, but me and her talk today and what Kathy wants to do with that hundred dollar bill is we're going to take and we're going to fill up the good Samaritan boxes. A lot of you don't, a lot of you know, and a lot of you don't know, we've got some Samaritan boxes that feeds the homeless. I don't know what John and them still bidding on that item done sold at least to pay. Sorry. Uh, but, uh, we fill up them Samaritan boxes and other people do. Lisa Payne's filled them up for it. Other people, my customers have, uh, and some others that told me not to tell and you know who you are, but uh, she said, take that hundred dollar bill and we're going to, we're going to take and uh, uh, she can go with me. Won't to, we're going to, we're going to buy some viney sausage crackers, uh, Ramon noodles and stuff and try to get them filled up with that hundred dollar bill. And we're going to move the one from alcohol apartments up to in front of the store. And we're actually Kathy. I hadn't told her this, but we're going to put Herb's name on it and maybe a picture of him on it and sort of dedicate that Samaritan box to Herb Gillot in memory of him. Uh, we may repaint it a little bit and uh, do some Vietnam stuff on it, red white, uh, red, white, and blue. And we're going to dedicate that to Herb. 
and it'll sit right up on the square. It's gonna sit right beside the other one that's donated, that's that's uh, um, dedicated to another little girl that died. We're gonna set it in front of that. We may paint it red, white, and blue stripes like Herb would like. Maybe put a picture of him on that, and then we'll we'll take and buy the paint and stuff with this, and then we'll fill up the boxes with it. And Kathy just felt like it would be, uh, uh, since she is my sister, it would be right to do that. And now if you guys win money, don't feel obligated to do that. But me and her just talked about it. And with her being my sister, she didn't want nobody. And I know nobody would get upset. They know I wouldn't pull no uh, uh, monkey business or anything. But we wanted to do that. And it all worked out great. Her's been dead, I think, a year ago. It was yesterday, I think, or the day before yesterday. So we're going to get that. We're going to get that done one day this week. All right. So we got that out of the way. Now we're going to sell a come along. Now this is a big one. <laughs> They're gonna have to lift it for me. This thing is heavy, heavy and it looks good, good shape. It's not oh, stretched. Yeah. It's got your little whatever that thing is for that. Four legs. Yeah. On the big come along here. Somebody said they're in about thirty dollars, and let's go. I got 10 from Angela. That's a starting bid. Thank you for that starting bid. I got 15. I got 15 on the come along. And what was it, Eric? I told him we'd have some more of tonight. I, I can't remember. And I think some people are behind. We're at $15. I got 17 and a half. And this is a nice come it's along, nice. guys. It's heavy duty. And guys, we're going to have some more tools. Let me show y'all real quick while you're bidding on that. Look at that welder. If you guys are interested in welding, it's got the stand and everything with it. It's one of what they call a, a feed welder yep. that feeds it. Yep. It's got the stand and everything with it. It's a flux core 80. A yep. flux core 80. Did you yep. look it up and sort of see an estimate? What are they I don't know what the stand brought. The stand's yeah. separate. Yeah. 20 yeah. 20 the stands are separate. I got 20 from Wendell Key. No, I had 20 from Todd Payne first, so I need 22 and a half. It's got gloves. Got it out. Yeah, it's got everything there. We'll be selling. And I do have another that you guys was wanting to. Uh, Lucy, the auction means we, we put an item up here and people bid on it. The highest bidder gets the item. David said he was out. I've got Todd Payne in. I got Wendell Keith at twenty two fifty. Uh, but we've got another slot machine that works great. Uh, for you that want it for your man cave and my kids came out here and they was loving it. I reckon people have been playing it all day. So we're going to be selling it tonight. Uh, now I do have like on the truck. I know one night this week we'll be selling uh Oh, thanks for bidding Todd and everybody else sold the window key for 22 and a half. I'll let you guys grab that. How much gas did it take Charles? $60. Yeah. Okay. That one's done then, right? Yeah. That's where I can Oh, Melissa, I'm sorry. You came in there late, Gail. No, I'll take a bite. I, uh, I, I said I didn't have a lot of glassware, but this is a nice piece of art glass. That's where they had a sticker on it, because like I said, this guy ran an antique mall and things like that. It had a sticker on there, and that paper would come right off. But this is a pretty piece right here of art glass. Very pretty vase right there. Hey. Uh, <laughs> I got two and a half from Melissa McCardo. Yeah. Don't forget about Facebook. We also take Facebook payments too. Yeah, we do a Facebook payment, uh, PayPal Square, uh, check, cash, food stamp card. <laughs> And I can't believe I only got a two dollar and a half bid on this beautiful art glass. Mm. Two and a half would you go five? 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 Somebody said it's green stamps. We'll take green stamps. Green stamps too, Angel. <laughs> Charles, give me which is three dollars. I'm gonna try some of these. Okay, Grant. Okay, Even if I work, yeah. Tell you one you need to try to. Is it all the same? Yeah, all that okay. can do. Uh, Evan, you all, what you got to do right now? If you've not been a, uh, if you're not registered, first of all, you got to get registered, and you message me your name, physical address, and phone number, because we are a licensed auction house, and I am a licensed auctioneer, 
and you, you do bid, enter into a binding contract when you bid on an item and win it. So there's all the information. Just send that to us. And then uh, when we get ready, ready to bill you, we'll do it either through PayPal, Square, and we'll be in contact with you with your phone number and stuff. And if you haven't got a message on your phone, you're on landline, you can go to my Facebook page, Jury Whitney, and uh, just send it through Messenger. I'm up to the 5,000 limit, so I can't take no more friends right now, but I think you can still send me a message. And welcome in, Evan. Yeah, I remember the do bills. And we got Kathy get like $3, and now we're selling that. All right, guys, you, you people that are fans of X-Men, right here you go. Nice little X-Men little figure right here. Magneto. Magneto. Yeah, Ray, I can remember them. And you have to be 18 to enter into a binding contract with us. But you're welcome to watch if you're not 18. Or you can get your mom and dad uh, oh, to bid for you. If you see something you like, just have them to send their name and information. That'd be fine, Kevin. All right, on this right chair, you comic book people, uh, Jerry Whitney. And it'll be... Uh, You'll see my cowboy hat and everything. Just type in Jerry Whitney and Facebook. And like I said, I can't accept no more friends, but I think I can still get your message. Oh, Lord, we're, we're only up by three. Yeah, it's going to be a hard game. Yeah. <laughs> All right. There you go. All right, we're getting any bids on this? Two and a half on it. Oh, it grows, Charles. Yeah, they get bigger. You put them down in water and it grows. All right. Somebody set it in two and a half, whatever you want to set it in at. I got two and a half from Ruth Rice, and I'm selling it for two and a half. And Ruth, I've got one, two, three, four of them total. You can put them back to get for Christmas gifts or birthday gifts or whatever. Do you want all four of them? I got a total of four. Two for Ruth. Anybody else want the other two? At just two dollars and a half a piece, like I said, be good gifts to send to school if you need to send it for birthdays or something like that, or say for grandkids or a neighbor kid's birthday party or something like that. That's what uh, I like to do. I like to keep stuff like this, and then when the neighbor kids or your kids get invited to a birthday party, you can you can already have the stuff ready to go. Easter, Kathy gets the other two. Kathy takes the other two. All right, guys, raise your sights on this one now. But this is old new stock, Buffalo Bill Cody. It's got his hat and his gun. And Charles, this is probably the 70s, ain't it? 75. 1975, guys. And it's still the box is in excellent condition. Look at there at that. <coughs> There's the way he looks. This is 1975. This is a collector one. Awesome. Yeah, old new stock. I mean, that's 25, 35, almost 43, what, 44 years old. It'll be worth yeah, that's that right there is a good piece. And, and I've got seven and a half from uh, Ruth Rice. I got 10 from Peter. This is a nice piece right here. And this is the kind of items we like to get. I got Ruth Rice at 15. Yeah, they're worth about fifty dollars. Charles said he looked them up today, and they're they're about fifty dollars worth. Who made it? Who made it, Peter? Uh, I think it's Global made them, didn't it? Uh, ClassicCityToys.com, figure toys company. Are you sure it's seventy five? I don't think they had dot coms in seventy five. No, it's not Charles. Is this a repop? That's a repop one, man. It's dot com. The repops are going for about twenty nine. So they're still way under what it is. Yeah. And we're going to sell it for fifteen to Roof Rice. Now I've got everybody likes old grass sack. Y'all remember when we used to have grass sack races? This would have been a good one to have your grass sack. That's a little damp. Is over where that water was. We'll have Probably. to hang it up and dry it up. We can do that. There's a good grass sack right here. That's I guess nice. what came in it. 
Coffee. Carblanca. Coffee came in it. <laughs> Remember we used to get in these things and have a grass sack race? I ain't going to do it tonight or I'll hurt my back even worse. That's in good shape there. A little grass sack right there. Somebody said they're in about $10 and let's go. On the old grass sack. Get enough of them, y'all have a grass sack race. And I do have some quilts, more quilts tonight, guys. Set her in at five then. On the old grass sack. Now, this is not a thin one. This is real heavy because coffee beans came in it. That eBay? No. Yeah, I've got two sets of them. So. Mm -hmm. And the BBs, too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you can gather walnuts in them, whatever you want to. Somebody give me two and a half. That's it, a spider in there. Thanks for bidding, uh, Peter, on that. And there are people like just to have them to hang up, too, the old grass sacks. We'll see if we get a bit on that. Uh, don't have any holes in it, Angela. No holes in it. Those you could only get craft mac and cheese. Uh, yeah, Excuse both of them's in. Uh, big shout out for Austin and Jose, a channel in. Uh, they just hit the message from me. Yeah, we'll give you a big shout out, Austin and Jose. And we're gonna we got three dollars. Uh, I had two fifty from Angela Wolf. Guys, that's cheap for that. That's a nice one. Yeah, that is cheap for that heavy one right there. And oh, Ricardo's got it at three, and it's we're fixing to sell it because I gotta move on. A lot of items to move tonight. So for three dollars to Ricardo up in Michigan, I think. Now, guys, you remember these, don't you? Craft mac and cheese. Craft macaroni and cheese. E -T. E -T. Is we want to put these out now? These are older ones right here. Remember the ET? Old new stock right here. Nice little collectible here. Somebody give me 10 on it and let's go. ET bone on. I got 250 from Twala Martin. Two fifty bid to go five. Two fifty bid to go five. Two fifty bid to go five. Y'all not looking here. If you're into collecting little toys and stuff, there you go. That's a nice one. I got five, seven and a half, five dollar bid to go. Bendies. Huh? Bendies. Bendies. Yeah. Yeah, the and they bend. I got five and eight six, guys. Next bid on that. Well, who took some of them out of that? Or? Oh, need to snap that back on. We got five from uh, got seven. We got seven from Kathy Gillock. Need eight, and those probably value fifteen or twenty bucks at least, Charles. Probably more than that. Isn't yeah, probably more than that, that, more likely. Most nice craft mac and cheese makes a lot of money. Yeah, you don't find them uh, that often with this box in that good a shape. I got seven dollars from Kathy Gillock. Need eight, and we're gonna sell out to Kathy. And I've got two of them, guys. This guy, like I said, was an antique uh, collector, and he had a lot of collectible items. Uh, do you want two, Kathy, or just one? And then I'll see if uh, uh, Merle is my backup bidder and Amy. Just one. All right. Uh, Linda Marie Edwards, which is Merle Blankenship Jr. Do you want the other one at $7? And if not, I'll ask Amy if she wants the other one at 7 Somebody's bumping from me here. Oh, big man. No. No. Amy, do you want it? Amy, would you like it for seven dollars? Yes. Okay, Amy. Amy gets it. Yeah. 
All right, who got the coffee thing there? That's a different one. Oh, that's a different one? Yeah. Oh, well, I like that one for sure. All right, guys. The next item we got up for bids. Thank you, Amy, for taking that. We have got a bubble gum machine. Now, this is metal. It's not one of the plastic ones, and it does have the glass globe, and it does work, and it's got the little uh, uh, bubble gum thing. It lifts up and lets your bubble gum come out, and it doesn't take a key, so you don't have to worry about losing a key. You just undo this top right here, and it's got the, head, the metal bottom on it. This is a nice one right here. This thing stands about probably 17, 18 inches tall, and it is nice. Somebody said they're in about $30. I got a $15 start mid. We'll take that. And let me show y'all how good it works. And that way I'll give y'all a penny. I want to put an old wheat penny in there. Or Indian head penny. Oh, it works good, guys. Works great. And I got a $15 bid from Roof Rice. Need 17 and a half to go any further. Opal Hayes is in there at 17 and a half. I don't know if you can buy bubble gum anymore for a penny a piece or not. How you doing tonight, hon? Yeah. You come on over here. Unless you want it by the law, and then we can't let you be on TV. No, you come on over here by the, with them over here. Oh, hiding out. I got 20 from Roof for Ice first, 22 and a half from Edna Brown. A lot of people interested in this one. Like I said, it's not one of them old plastic ones. No, it's, it's a heavy glass. You hear me, hear me hitting my wedding band there. And I got 22 and a half from Edna Brown first. Need 25. 30. I got 30 from Roof for Ice. She ain't playing no reindeer games. Worth every penny. Uh, this is the key that goes to that one. Put it down in the slot thing there. Yeah, it's a nice one. Ooh, that's, that's nice. They're getting me some stuff lined up here, guys, so I don't have to do so much walking. I got thirty-two fifty from Moms to All Dyer. Now, what's her first name? So I don't have to. Huh? Rosetta. I got Rosetta thirty-two fifty first. Need thirty-five roof. Thanks for bidding, hon. Oh, I need thirty-five. You need some help get with that. You got it. You sure? Thank you so much, hon. Go, now go home and be buying some more stuff. 35. Edna. <laughs> All right. See, I got 35 from Edna Brown. Amanda, just bring that paperwork and leave it up here, and we'll try to get you some orders for that because I do want some of the Krispy Kremes, okay? Opal Hayes is out. Okay, Opal's out, so we sold that to Edna Brown. Thank everybody for bidding. Edna Brown got that one. Now, guys, we like I said, we do have some tools. This is a nice little uh, uh, this what is this a car charger? One of the little lightweight car chargers. Battery charger. Battery charger, a little lightweight. Oh, mom came in late. Oh, mom, uh, Rosetta, you came in late. I done sold it. I'm sorry. They might have put her in timeout where she uh bid YouTube would do that. We done we done sold it, uh, but we do have some more now. We got some better ones, not like that. We got some that's actually on a stand. Mm -hmm. All right, on the little charger here, you guys been wanting some different uh, guy stuff. It does work. Yeah, Ruth, uh, I'll have Amanda just bring that paper up here, and y'all can just sign up for it there. It's not a bad deal. I got five dollars now. This is a nice little charger here. It's not one of the old big bulky things that you have to have. I got ten from Alice Huff. I mean, it's all in good shape there and everything. And I got a ten dollar bid. Going to be a good auction tonight, guys. I can just feel it. I hope they bring me some boxes of nice glassware things like that. <laughs> I mean, the auction pace will probably pick up here in a little bit. I'm getting my back sort of walking around a little bit, worked in a little bit so where it's not hurting so bad. I got 10 from Alice Huff, and that's going to be a good buy. Because you can't buy any. Uh, I got 10, 12 and a half. Did you get the prints out, Charles? They weren't on in my truck. 
They probably on that one. That's the first one we loaded. I handed okay. them some and they put some on the back of the truck. Uh, sold Alice up for ten dollars. That She's, was a deal, right? Yeah. And we got some hot a hot wheel carrier here, and there's not many in this, guys. Just some on one size, but you're getting the hot wheel carrier. There's not many in that, but this is good to put your hot wheels in. These things cost a little bit. Now I've got to snap that back on there. It's not broke, is it? it just needs snapping on, Charles. No, they're not. Well, what a may be. That one may be. We've got Amanda Huffy in there. Ain't that many cars in there, but that's what you're getting, the little carry thing for your Hot Wheels. No, they were on $19 for that one. For them? Uh, for the, just the tray. Yeah, just the tray. <laughs> Andy brought my supper out here tonight, guys. She says I'm getting too fat. <laughs> She's put me on celery and peanut butter. <laughs> got Twala Martin at five. Sold it. No, it's really good. I like it. Twala. She was eating on it. She gave me some of it. Now, look at this, guys. NASCAR Race Day Hot Wheels. This is the big one. That's Andretti. Who is it? Andretti. Mario? Uh, or his son. That? Some one of his boys. I can't think of which one it is. But he's racing for Patty. Uh, subscribe. You pay through PayPal, Facebook Pay, or through the Square that we use. And you have to be registered to be in. Yes, Twyla, you won that. Now, wouldn't that be funny if that was the big money winner tonight? He said you're not going to make it till midnight. <laughs> I got ten dollars, guys. Look how nice that is. In great shape. I got a ten dollar bid already, uh, Margaret. It's not good, Margaret. <laughs> I got twelve fifty from Kathy Grant. I've not been able to eat a lot today. <laughs> I got twelve fifty from Kathy Grant. You're welcome. Subscribe. No, it's not rusty. Brand new. Who is that number? That's not like Richard Petty. Forty three. Forty three. No, he always drove the car. He owned the car. Yeah. I figured that that was his number. Who is that racing guy? Uh, Merle, we after we get past ten dollars is two fifty increments, two fifty bid increments. So I need fifteen. Oh, the next board. next bid increment. <laughs> they keep their auction going a little faster, and it oh, keeps them being bored. I'm looking to see if I've got mine on. Let's see which Andretti this is. Is it his son? Yeah. But I need fifteen. It's John. John Andretti. Yeah. Or Kyle Petty. They're saying. No, John Andretti. Oh, it's on there. Carl Petty drove 42. Anyway, we need $15. <laughs> I got Kathy Grant at 1250. Merle, the bid increments has got to be 250 at a time after we pass 10 to keep the auction going. And I'm fixing to sell it to Kathy Grant if somebody don't bid 15 on it. Sold. <laughs> Kathy Grant. All right, guys. Now, this is an old creeper, and it's in great shape. Look at this old creeper. When that look good in your garage, that's probably from the 70s at least. Craftsman. How's the pillow? That's in good shape. The pillow on it. Yeah, it is. All the wheels are in good shape. A little creeper right here. I got back in at five, five dollar bid to go ten, five, ten. Don't think about celery. It takes you forever to get it chewed up. <laughs> but it's good. It's for in you. great shape. There's nothing wrong with it. Now we'll take it over here and go down the hill. We'll show you right now. Yeah. <laughs> Who needs I'll snow? On it, Charles. Who I got needs ten snow for Biggie Long. That's a high bid right now.
Surprise kids don't do that. I got 10, 12 and a half, $10. Baby, we go 12 and a half. 10, oh, yeah. 12 and a half. <laughs> well, you had a sticker on it, $25. Yeah. <laughs> I took dad's and went down the hill off that plane one time. Crazy. Yeah, that's $50 yeah. right now, every bit of it. Yep. About $12.50. Pain. I got Lisa Payne in right now, twelve fifty, guys. I'm gonna give it just a second, and then we're gonna sell it. It's even got guys. It's even got on it Sears and Roebuck Company. That tells you how old it is. They haven't been called Sears and Roebuck in a long time. Well, they're not even called Sears. <laughs> All right, anybody else bid on it? We're nope. at twelve fifty. Sell it. Yeah, that would be a little hard to ship. Oh, but it ain't heavy, Lisa. Ricky said he doesn't need it, so we're at twelve fifty. Lisa Payne, goodbye right there, Lisa. Now, guys, look at this. Who remembers playing this when they was a kid? This is the photo electric football game, National Pro Football Hall of Fame game. Shit, you probably couldn't afford that when you was a kid. I didn't have it. Those things were expensive. I ain't never seen that. I want to look at it. Definitely a vintage toy here. <laughs> I want to look at it, Charles. No. This one used cards. I never seen it. Yeah. I had one. Oh, look there, Charles. Yeah. There's your scoreboard. Yeah. There's your football field. That's your football field? Yeah, you got to take this out. Oh, it's electric. Yeah. What you do... Is you run these these cards in here, and it does the plays right there. Oh, <laughs> pretty cool. Was it by Coleco? Uh, who made? Yeah, Cle when it Coleco made these. Was it? No, Catico. Catico made these. Be a good game to set up in a man cave too. You know, watching the football and all that stuff. I got five from Cynthia Pettigo. And now Indy's got me started on this celery and peanut butter. I can't quit. <laughs> I'll stick with the celery and ranch. <laughs> I'm fixing to sell that, Charles. Where nobody else is bidding. Oh, what a. Cynthia's going to win that. It's got the cards, Joey. And Joey does have the cards. Does have the cards, Joey, and the plug. You're at six now. You're at 15. Well, Ronald, I'm double dipping. That way nobody else won't eat none of it. Linda must have looked it up. Because <laughs> she went 15 quick. Yeah. <laughs> Ricky's going to sell a purse next. Add your purse. You're at 15. We're going to let him sell the girly stuff. All right. Me and Charles sell the manly stuff. <laughs> All right. You're going to let it go 15? Sell it. What's the, uh, is that her, is that her real name? I'm no, gonna, that's moral, right? I'm going to tell them what they give for this purse. It's a navy blue Agner purse. It is brand new. And it's got a $120 price tag. Agner, ain't it? Yep. And it's leather. And it's real. Hold over that way in the light. I hit it better, Reggie. It is real. $120 price tag. <laughs> Melissa Plano, here we are. We started it's out with Percy Shirley tonight. Melissa. Three pockets inside. And I got a 1750 bid. Asking for 20. Oh, it is a $120 purse. Right. The price there. tag is on it. BJ's in at 20. $20. Asking for 2250. Twenty-five. Where's women? Twenty dollar purse. Asking twenty-seven fifty. <laughs> Plus Charles. <laughs> they need it. Diane, Michael we done Kors got twenty-five. Scary, We're asking twenty-seven fifty. And this is the There's strap. There's Michael Kors on that truck. 
Did you see right that, Jerry? Oh. That's Michael Core on that truck. I hope they bring it back. What a thunder is this? That is a. That's a plate. Yeah. DJ wants to see the handle. Ricky. It's it's brand new. There's the handle. I don't know what that is. It hangs on the wall. Twenty-seven fifty asking thirty. BJ's got it. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Asking thirty. Okay. Uh, we got a guy. Asking thirty two fifty. Diane's got it. Huh. There goes the light plug. There goes that hell. Yep. That took them long enough. Maybe they did something over, I think they were doing. Need 3250. WKU. I'm telling you, it looked like a black and white. 3250. Asking 35. It is a navy blue. Blue, y'all. 3250. Asking 35. We got 3250. Kathy Grant. Kathy, we've got 35, Kathy, asking 3750. It is brand new. I took the packaging out of it, the paper. Got 35. Oh, no. Asking, the got 3750 yeah. from Kathy. Yeah. Asking 40. It is brand new. There's the bottom. Here's the back. It's got a pocket in there, too. Got 40. $40 from Lisa Young. Asking forty two fifty. Who made it? Agner. Agner purse. Forty two fifty asking forty five. Kathy, you have got it right now. Adjust camera. Need forty or forty-five. Okay, Lisa's out. We got it forty-two. Kathy, I think they're out. I'm selling it. So, Kathy Grant. Kathy Grant. So. Guys, I've got a 1942. See if the camera will adjust it. There it is. 1942 Mercury Head Dime. Oh. 1942 Mercury Head Dime. I got Randy Maynard. Starting it out at ten dollars. Fifteen with Nolan. Got fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. Fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. Got fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. On a nineteen forty two Mercury Head dime. I got fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. Fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. I got fifteen looking for seventeen and a half. Randy's out. A nice one. Yeah. Anybody else in? Yeah. What's the mint mark? You would ask somebody. It's half blind, Mike. <laughs> Hold on, Mike. Let me look. If I can hold it, I can't see it myself. If I can hold it up there close enough. Can y'all make that out? It's right there on the end of the year. I can't make it out myself. Let me see it. I've got my uh, You got your specters on. Hold on one second, guys. Is it deep? I found the basket. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And a gigano. I want to mint mark on the dime. The what? The mint mark. If it's she's not got it wrote on her, it's not got one. Okay. She's done looked. It's just a Philadelphia. Oh, it's Philadelphia. And what is I'm that at, a Mercury Head? Yeah. What year is it? 42. 1942. I'm at $15. $15. Yeah. 
15, looking for 17 and a half. 15, yeah, guys, we're going to throw a lot of these in during the night. We don't want to bore you with a lot of corns or a lot of nice, but we are going to throw some of that in. And we're going to sell that to Nolan Frazier for $15. All right, Charles, what are these right here? I'll get that for you. Oh, Lord. Let's go back to Coleco, guys. Burn, Ricky? Uh, what'd you first burn? Look at here. Activision. All these right here. These three are Activision. Coleco, Donkey Kong. We've got a Parker Brothers Frogger. Activision. <laughs> and a iMagic Star Voyager. I put Fraser's Charles out on the E. Okay. Now, guys, if y'all have got any of these machines in mint condition, you definitely got some cash because these games haven't been. <laughs> but you're going to get all one, two, three, four, five, six, all six games for one money. That's nice. That's nice. And I'm at ten dollars with Jody Key. And looking for twelve. <coughs> How many you got there? Two, four, six, six of them. Oh, I don't even know if kids remember how to even know how to play these games. <laughs> I ain't got enough buttons. On. Uh, who is Jason? Jason Belosi. Jason Belosi. Huh? Which one she going to? Oh, the Mexican one out here. Oh, there by save a lot. Right Jason Belosi, are you registered? You've got to be registered before you can be a Jason. And you got to send all your information right up there because we are a licensed auction company. Uh, okay, registered. Jason, you have to register before you can bid. Just send all your information to that, Jason, then we'll let you bid, okay? And we got more old video games, too. Yeah. A lot of, we have a lot of good items like this, Jason. Um, $10. Okay. okay, you got to be rested to be in because uh, um, that way it keeps down people from not paying and stuff. But you're welcome to watch, buddy, okay? We're going to sell that to Jody Key for $10. That's a good buy right there. there. What'd you have, Ricky? I didn't have anything. It's still a sound bike, Jerry. Just let them see yeah. what they had on me. Yeah. Well, I'm going to show them what they had on me. Uh, we got this. I'm going to move this back for you, Ricky. This is what they had on it for a price. At the storage unit. It doesn't have that. the handles, does it? No. Nope. Oh, that's a different one right there. That's, that's a nice one there. It does not have the handles on it. But look, guys, they had a $100 bill for this. What would y'all start me out at? They had a $100 on it. Y'all start you out at $250. What would y'all start me out at? And it is short. Yeah. Let's show you out of 10. Well, I'm going to sell it some. Look at $10 right off the bat. $10. There you go. That's a. It's a deal started. And, and Glenn, I'm sorry we didn't get them up last night. I know Joseph <laughs> said you wanted to put up, and we didn't get them put up. And I apologize. We got them up tonight. Hello, Joni. It's a five foot. No, it's six foot blade. Yeah. Six foot blade. Now we'll take this off. Somebody give me twelve fifty. I bought one of them other night. Fifteen. Asking seventeen and a half. Rebecca, you've got it at fifteen dollars. Asking seventeen and a half. What's your? We got seventeen and a half. Asking for twenty. Yes, it depends on where you're located and how heavy the item is. Jerry, how high? Well, we won't be able to ship that. Items that y'all. We do ship them, but we won't be able to ship something like that. Let me turn around the other way, Charles. Yeah, you're right. Get that more. That looks like too much work. You're at seventeen fifty, Ricky. Yeah, they used to work back in. We'll go ahead and sell both of them, Ricky, too. Both we can of sell them? that next. I mean, after you get done selling this one. 
Oh, Ricky got excited. He thought you saw him again. Somebody give no. me twenty dollars. <laughs> Let's go. He was gonna bid on it. That's heavy. What are you talking about cooking a lot of chicken in that? I want to keep that. Can't keep everything. Seventeen and a half <laughs> asking for twenty. Not going to be big enough, but that would be good in a. Eddie's uh, got this at seventeen uh, fifty, so asking for twenty. Anybody else want to bid on this saw blade? One doesn't have. Uh, go ahead and go ahead and sell, sell it. it. So, okay. All right, go ahead and sell the other one. This is the longer one out here, Ricky. It's got the handle on it. Then got the handles. Oh, it's got one on it. One handle. One handle. It's about seven and a half foot long. Yeah, this is a, just put a long one on this one. Here. This does have a handle on one end. It does another hand. The other end, but it's it got, does but it's got, got, got the, the uh, It's got the right, the brackets for it. It's got the hardware on the end. I'll it's show it. Show it. He's gonna show y'all. That's the hardware on the end. We got a welder coming up next. And there's what the handle looks like on the other end. What would y'all start me at out on this? Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen. Eddie knows he's getting bargains on these. Somebody gave me 17 and a half. Oh, wow. 17 and a half. Asking for 20. Oh, yeah. This does have the handle on one end. And we had a guy that helps us. We got 20 asking for 2250. He gave me an idea on them, on the handles. He said just take an old broken uh, shovel handle. And whittle it out on one end and stick it right on there. It looked good. Ask him for twenty two fifty. We got twenty on this. Give them a little time. Rebecca might want to bid on it. Mike West said, "Sell it." Military issue. Won't you buy it, Mike? I'll sell it to you. Well, yeah, Ricky. You tell me, Ricky. $20. Sell it to him. So, <laughs> you got to yell at me? Jesus. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> raise your sights now, guys. We do have a reserve, little reserve on this. Y'all understand why? Because we might just have one person needing a welder. This is a, now we've got the stand that it rolls on. That's a nice setup. Right yeah. We're going to include this welding helmet right here. Got gloves. Brand new gloves. And it's got that Brand right gloves. there. Got your welding gloves. And it don't look like it's been used very much at all. Look like it's got the factory. Uh, Lou said he buys. Live near us. Anybody else having trouble with YouTube? Mine keeps going on and off. That could be one of these. I figured them saws would have brought more. I figured the saws would have brought more than that. Too. Campbell Hossfield. Mm hmm. Water feed welder. Or did you say that one of them comes from? They sell them at Lowe's. It's got a helmet. Charlene's buffering, so they may be having the same problem. There's something wrong. There's some blank shit about more than that. It's keeping it. I believe it's brand new. It ain't been used much, Ricky. Well, I know that it used their gloves and everything. This looks like a factory smoke lane. Billy said Walmart sells them too. Walmart sells everything. <laughs> I said we pass one. Guys, and I don't think you get the stand at Walmart. These stands are probably forty or fifty bucks. Just for the stand. I don't think the stand comes with them. I mean the stand's worth probably it's what a, up is it? Flux core eighty. Hundred and fifteen volt. <laughs> Oh, no. 
down a low and high. No, David, we won't plug it in because I wouldn't know what to do. I'll get electrocuted. We uh, guarantee it to it work. Took the breaker off. Yeah, they kicked the breaker. We guarantee it to work. The stands probably run 40 or 50 bucks. Yeah, but it's a 110 plug. Yeah. Yes, and we got a low reserve on it, guys. It's not a real high reserve that we got on it. We're only at fifty-five dollars. The stand would cost you probably fifty-five dollars by itself. What's Maiman? Maiman you get, you're getting the helmet. Brand new pair of gloves. I mean the gloves. The brush ain't even been used. Shows a plug, David. Stand. Sixty. It's a one ten plug, David. Sixty two fifty. Y'all look it up. 65. Yeah, Mike was looking at it today. 70. Is it raining again? I'll call. Is that all right, David? Any other 100. questions? Got Randy at 100. Randy ain't playing. And guys, that, was my, low, that was my low reserve. Randy looked it up. It is going to sell because I don't do no welding. And uh, the, and the stand, I'd say, would cost you at least 40 or 50 bucks by itself. It's good looking stand. I believe it's two hundred dollar outfit right there. They got a yeah, at least on not they counting the helmet. helmet. The yeah, we've got the helmet too, Norman. Or none of that. Yeah, we got a helmet ass. here. I'm holding on, Melissa. Randy already knows what it is. Somebody said they stand for <laughs> That's James. But I, like I said, I think the stand, which you know, this lifts up off the stand. One five. This lifts up off the stand. And the stand separately. So we're at 105. I'm going to try to do my auctioneering and now. We got it. Everybody's asked their questions. So I got 105. I'll be able to go 100. I got 125, 150. I'm holding on, Melissa. I'm holding on, honey. I got 125. What do you go? 150. 125. I'll be able to go 150. I got 125. I'll be able to go 150. Ronald said he was out. Thanks for bidding, Ronald. I got 125 with you. I'm holding on for Melissa. Melissa, let me know, okay? 130. I got 130, 150. 130, 150. 130, 150. Guys, I know this is a good buy right here, and we do guarantee it. I'm at 130, 130 140. 130 dollars be able to go 140. 130 dollars be able to go 140. 130. We will take five dollar increments. Remember that. I got 150. <laughs> Randy ain't playing no reindeer games. I got 150. And the only thing I'm waiting on right now for dropping the hammer and selling this, Melissa Collado asked me to hold on for a minute. She said, hold on. That's right, Jay. All right, thank you. Uh, thank you, Melissa, for checking it out. Randy, I'm going to do the countdown, buddy. $150 bid to go 155 going once. I got $150 bid from Randy Maynard. Go 155 going twice. Yeah, the cart's over 50. Yeah. It is. I got oh. 150 asking for 155. Excuse Third me. and final call, Randy Maynard. You have made a deal. We have sold it, sold it, sold it. That's a good buy right there, Randy. Randy. That was a good deal. Goodbye from Randy Maynard right there. And Melissa, I'm sorry you couldn't get to whoever it was. Just uh, I'm gonna sell all these together. I got a 1954. Where's my camera doing here? How you tighten that up, Charles? It's a, spinning on me. Uh, we've got a 1954 little fire truck, and then we got two of the tankers, two tank cars. Well, I know that's frustrating when you're trying to get somebody to answer, but that's what you're getting. Where are these diecast, Charles? Or no, they're plastic. No, they're metal. No, they're plastic. Mm -hmm. Pretty nice, though. You're welcome, Melissa. And congratulations to Randy on that good deal. You're getting all three of these for one money, guys. All three for one money. That discount that they just sold. All right, Charles, finish that up for me. Excuse me. Uh, you you ordered yet, Mama? No, not yet. I was gonna see what they want. I just like them with some rice and cheese. Maybe That's what I've got on everybody else right now so far. What, rice and cheese? Really, yeah. Oh. And then Ireland wants rice and cheese. I don't really want no meat. I texted you on it. 
I'm at five, looking for seven and a half. Five, looking for seven and a half. I'm at five, looking for seven and a half. I'm at five, looking for seven and a half. There we go. Five, looking for seven and a half. Five dollars, looking for seven and a half. I'm at five, looking for seven and a half. I'm at five, looking for seven and a half. Five, looking for seven and a half. Five, looking for seven and a half. Sold to Sue Gary. Oh, we're going to go over to. We're going to sell them all. Yeah, Calvin and Hobbs. Let me back it up so y'all can see it a little bit better. Calvin and Hobbs. Got, there's treasure everywhere. You see this, Jerry? Uh -huh. You see this, Jerry? Got. Uh -huh. We're looking for the volume. Yeah, I'm trying it's to. It's like old Jungle Cat. <laughs> and. Is that for all of them? Yep. Yeah. And the 10th anniversary book. That's four big, thick books. Five in house. Five in house. I got five, Bridget, in house first. I'm at. Five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. I got six looking for seven. Got seven looking for eight. I got seven looking for eight. Seven in house. Got seven looking for eight. Seven dollars looking for eight. Got seven looking for eight. Bridges out. Got seven looking for eight. Seven looking for eight. Got seven looking for eight. Seven looking for eight. So that to Leanne. Does anybody know what this is? You gonna bring that big plate over here? I don't know. I see him bring it there. I wanna have to bring it there. Big plate. Guys, wait till you see this. Just right Check that out, guys. Sure, <laughs> you might want to sell that. I know nothing about it. This is the actual plate in here, guys. That's a porcelain plate. It hangs on the you wall. You want me to take it in, dude? You got it. Don't touch it. You're not She's like, don't touch it. <laughs> this is actually a big plate, and I think that's a Venice or somewhere like that. That's Venice. There's damage right here. It hangs on the wall there. There's damage right here. A little big place right here on this. It's got... Both of these little sides got damaged. Gee, I would take this big plate out of here. That is a big plate. No telling what that thing's worth. You can bring it a little bit closer, Mom. I'm going to see the plate. Oh. I'll that is a big odd piece, guys. Those are tight measures. Jay. It's plastic around it, isn't it, India? Huh? It's plastic it's around it. It's got some great color. Mm -hmm. Well, it's plate 16 inches across. That's only the part you can see. Yeah, that's only the part. So we're talking probably 18 inches across. Can you move that table so I can get a good? I'll get that camera. I'm gonna set the camera right there. Five, I got five over here in my chair. Five, looking for seven and a half. You got five. Five, looking for. I'd say five looking for 20 on this. You got a reserve on this or no? Nope. We're at five dollars from in house. How tall is the whole entire thing? Uh, it's about four foot tall. The plate is probably 18 across. 18 across. 50 inches. <laughs> You're only at five dollars in house. You need that covered. Yeah, we'll need it. Five looking for six. Five looking for six. Sell it. Woo. Sold that in the house. Five dollars. And they got a deal. All right, guys. Raise your sights here. I'm going to have Charles and Ricky help me sell this. If you like the man cave stuff, this, this is, is brand is new. It. New old stock. This is nice. We're going right. to move the box. Got all the hard wire. This is the chain that it hangs on. This is lightweight, too. I'm on. Out here. Look at this, guys. Brand new old stock advertisement. And it does have the water where you run it out your window. It's a thermometer. Mm -hmm. 
They're going to plug it in. Look at that, that guys. And it's 88 degrees in here. And it does have a long. <laughs> oh, 67. Run it. Run it around. Probably show them that. Oh, it's. Probably it's 10, 10 foot. foot of cord on. Easy. For the longer. Yeah. And it's, it's got uh, enough cord here, probably 10 foot, to run out your window. It gives you the outdoor temperature. That is or you cool. can leave it hanging in your house. Now, this is brand new, guys. We it just took it out of the box. Mm -hmm. It's got the pull chain on it like that to turn it off <laughs> and turn it back on there. Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Look at this. I'd leave it brand new. Time. We got it in the box. Just took it out of the box. You lost You're it. probably looking at a $100, $150 item right here. It's just 66 degrees in here. <laughs> okay, way to go, UK. I mean, absolutely beautiful piece here, guys. Good advertisement, brand new. You're looking at well over $100, and I'm only at $25 from Ronald Dixon on this. And like I said, it's brand new, right out of the box. We still got the box. 30, 40, 40. <laughs> Jeff Tanner slacks it. Wait a minute, Jeff just be it out. He's been against Joni. <laughs> well, I think it's going to go for about 70 or 80. It's, I ain't got a reserve on this, guys. And like I said, these bar places will not sell you this stuff. No. They keep it. I got 42 and a half. Like I said, this is probably well over $100. This is mint shape. And I don't very call stuff mint, but it's because I just took it it's out of the box. It's banking note. Yeah, we got the box. Got the so it's, from, it's from 2011. So this was uh, nine years ago. We've got the chain. See, it's got the chain. It's got two hooks on each side here. It's got two hooks on each side. And it's the chain there that hangs it up for you. You run your cord outside, and it tells you the temperature. They start to bid now, Terry. You want to hold that there, Richard? $50. And y'all see how warm it is in this place. Like I said, it's all brand new. It'll come with a box and everything. $50 asking for 55 Probably well over $100, I'd say. In mint shape. You'll probably not find another one in mint shape like this. Right out of the box, brand new, from 2011. And I know I've asked these. No, that's a... That, when I worked for the Indians up there in Ohio, uh, redoing a motel, this is all they drank. And that's what the advertisement is for, Carla, to get you to do that. Thanks for bidding, Berlin. And I've got Ronald Dixon at 50, and we're going to start counting down. And that's cheap for this. I've sold older signs that uh, didn't, that was broke and everything for that. So I'm going to go $50, be able to go 55 I got a $50, be able to go 55 Somebody take care of Bruno. I got $50, be able to go 55 Going once. Berlin, are you sure? It'll look good in that man cave. Steve Metter, where you at? I got fifty dollars. I got fifty-five from Linda King. I think Steve had to work. Yeah, Pete knew too. He knew about them cores like. No, I got fifty-five from Linda King. Thanks for bidding, Ronald. I got fifty-five. Fifty-five dollar bid to go sixty. Fifty-five dollar bid to go sixty. Going once. You guys better look them up real quick because it's fixing the sale. I can't do it. No, it won't let me for some reason. I got fifty-five dollar bid. Asked him for 60, second call. It's worth I got it, a $55 bid from Linda King. I'm asking for $60. Third, and I've got 57 and a half. We'll take that. Now I need 60. $57. $57.50, would you go 60? I got a $57.50 bid from Jeff Sinners. Would you go 60? $57.50, Amanda or, or somebody take care of Bruno. It's starting to get on my nerves. $57.50, would you go 60? Going once. Thank you for bidding, Linda. We don't understand that stuff. 5750, would you go 60 for the second time? Guys, you're going to wish you had them. 5750, brand new, old stock, last call. And I don't know where all my moderators are at. He's, he's, he's got it set up. <coughs> he's got it set up where you can't do it. There we go. You I don't think it, he's Linda. Right. No, James I'm, did. I'm, I'm, I'm right 60, now, I've got 60, 60 for Ronald Dixon. See, see, Jeff Sinners, that guy from Brazil cost you money. <laughs> I'm at 60, 65. 60 dollars will be able to go 65. They're looking him up now is what they're doing. Coffee. I got 60. <laughs> now Jeff's out. That's what Ronald said a while ago. Are you sure, Jeff? I got 60, go 65. 
I figured Berlin would jump back in here this now. It's worth a hundred dollars. $125, easy. That's I got sixty dollar bid to go sixty five. Second call. I got sixty dollar bid from Ronald Dixon, who said he was out, but jumped back in there, asked for sixty five. Third, Gioni said she sure led Jeff through the talking. Right. Johnny, Johnny. <laughs> Sold Johnny's it to Ronald crying. Dixon. It's too late now. Sold it. Goodbye, right there. Goodbye. Throw it back in the box. Proud of you, Ronald. That was a good buy on that. We're going to put it back in the box. Here's the, the chain that goes with it. It's got the instructions and everything. Guys, now, Joni, you got to let Jeff buy that slot machine in a little bit or try at least bid on it, okay? It's a working slot machine, and it's cool. It's fun. It, it takes quarters, and it's a fun little slot machine, okay? We'll be selling it in a little bit. I'm going to let Charles sell a welding helmet. This is one of the nicer Lincoln welding helmets right here. Who bought it? These things run pretty high. Jeff said, Jeff said, oh, it's getting, did you see what Jeff said? He said, I wear the pants in this house. Oh, oh, the cat hair is going to be flying. Hey, Jeff, how comfortable is that squad car? <laughs> he said, after I wash and put him up. <laughs> He said, after I wash, you put them up. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, Jeff and I was going to tell you, Amanda is selling donuts on here. Jeff Sanders. Amanda Huff is selling donuts, so you need to get a hold of her. I got $5 for Jody Key. And that's dust there. It's dust, guys. This came out of storage. It's a Lincoln Electric. That's a good one. It's a good face shield. Is that Hello Kitty? Yes, yeah. Yeah, I got another little And I got seven. Jeff put what Jeff say? He put donuts, donuts in the squad car. <laughs> That's all he needs. He only needs a donut in the squad car. <laughs> um sister, yes. We've got uh you've got oh. something to send uh Winnipeg now. I don't know if we deliver to Canada. Crispy cranes. <laughs> I'm sure she can handle that. Yeah, donuts in Canada. Oh, Amanda, you can send her some Krispy Kreme donuts up there, sure. <laughs> and I'm at seven dollars on this. Krispy Kreme, sell it. Seven, looking for eight. Seven. Oh, Amanda, don't be that way. Got seven, looking for eight. Seven, looking for eight. Got seven, looking for eight. Charles, they were about forty, fifty dollars. Yeah, easily. I got eight looking for nine. See, I, see, I done put you in, Amanda. You have to go with it now. Where's got Randy ten. At? Got ten looking for twelve and a half. I got ten looking for twelve and a half. Got Melissa Colado at ten. I got ten looking for twelve and a half. Randy got one with his welding machine a while ago. Uh, is it auto darkening? I, I, I think it is, uh, Brian. I think it is. It's Lincoln Electric. Some of them, Jerry, that Charles I Charles looks like something from Star Wars. Is it, you could be looking through it and then start welding it. Just yeah. Yeah, it's auto it. dark. If it is, it's high. 12 Randy 50. said 12 you got 12 50 looking for 15 now. 12 yeah, that's a little better 15. than the one that was with that uh, equipment a while ago, Randy. You got 15 looking for 17 and a half. 15 looking for 17 and a half. Yeah. Anything and Lincoln's pricey on their stuff. <laughs> What's this right here? I got 15 looking for 17 and a half. Is that, a, is that two? That's two. two no, okay. I got 20. I got 20 looking for 22 and a half. That's two different things. I don't know. I got 20 looking for 22 and a half. Well, they get time to sell that slot I got 20. Well, we got 156 people right now. People. <laughs> I got 22 and a half looking for 30. Show the inside. There you go. Yeah, nine dollars a dozen. That's pretty much what you're gonna pay anywhere at a Krispy Kreme. So it's no major markup on them. 22 and a half looking for 30. 22 and a half looking for 30. 22 and a half looking for 30. Sold that for 22 and a half to uh, Melissa Collado. Guys, we got another one. 1942 dime. 
Philadelphia. Another 1942 dime. Right here. Look at that one. I'm going to try and get that. I, over I got Randy Maynard in at 1250 on it coming out the gate. I got 1250 looking for 15. And another 1942 Mercury head dime. I got 12 and a half. They're, they're talking about donuts. <laughs> We're talking about donuts. Get back in this auction, girl. Y'all making me hungry. I got 42 and a half. Uh, I got 12 and a half looking for 15. 12 and a half looking for 15. Nolan will come in there, I bet you, or Edna. I think Nolan got the last one. I got. Nobody bid on Charles. Let it roll. Sold it to Randy Maynard for 12 and a half. And then sell this right here. Just throw that in for good measure. That's the main thing. Yeah. Hello, kitty. Hello, Hello kitty. Tie beanie, baby. Ain't it? Yeah, it's a tie. The little drawer here is in a little rough shape. But this is a nice little tie beanie baby there. Yep. Hello, kitty. And we've got a slot machine, guys. Coming up. It's called Go Ghost Rush Quarter Slot Machine. Is that the one we've been playing with all yeah. day? Quarter one. Okay. Joe open and get the quarters out. Yeah, I like it better than the one last it's night. It's Hello Kitty. Can I get a two fifty bid on Hello Kitty for a little girl? They can put their little jewelry and stuff in here. Five, five looking for seven and a half. Five looking for seven and a half. Five looking for seven and a half. Got five with Harry. Got five looking for seven and a half. Five looking for seven and a half. Five dollars looking for seven and a half. Sold it, Harry. Sold it, Harry. All right, raise your sights, guys. We, and, and once again, just like last night, we do have a reserve on this one. And the lights, it don't show up good with this camera. The lights down there and what it is. We may have to turn it off, Charles. How do I do that? What's it doing? Well, there it is. That's where I turned it on. Oh, let's put some money in it. What's it doing? I gotta let it come on. I gotta let it come on, they said. I had a button or something. I'll plug and put it back. The payout. Oh, you the payout. Pay pay well, it ain't what? got no quarters in it. I hit the payout button and it ain't got no quarters in it. Maybe I have to let it wait for a second. Yeah, I hit the payout and it, we, we emptied all the quarters on it. Let me show my watch unplug how good the graphics are on that, Ricky. Mm -hmm. This works great, guys. I hit the payout and we emptied all the quarters and it ain't got no uh the what? No, it's it's not broke. It's yeah, it is broke. Because we took all the quarters out uh, of it. Gotta hit the reset. It's on page what it says. Yeah, it's on payout. Huh? <laughs> they took the quarters out of it. Hey, what'd you do to it? Tell them pay out. There you go. Hit the way you say it. it. There you go. Oh, I don't know who General Patton is. Hit the reset. There you go. What'd that do? Said, it's still in where you say it. Huh? They said, open it. I'm trying to reset it. <coughs> hmm. Reset button. That turns it off. I don't know where the reset button is. Right there. You just did it. Did that do it? Yeah. 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 We don't know who General Patton is. Here. General Patton, who are you? All right, guys, we're going to. Don't say George. <laughs> well, what I, hit, I didn't turn it back on. Oh, you did? No. No. Your machine requires an attendant, that, please. That bottom, <laughs> it's that bottom one, Jerry. The what? Uh, this be smart to that one right there. Is that the one you push oh. down? Is that the one I push down? Yeah. I don't know. When we played it all day long. There we go. There we go. Now we got it. It's just got a bunch of different switches in it. 
That's good. And I'm feeling it full of money here. Take care to get our back up there, Charles. We can't. Uh, Amanda Huff. Amanda, take care of Patton. Can they say it's funny? I just want something more. That ghost pays out. It takes Amanda. quarters. Nope. There it is, guys, and we do have a reserve on it. I love it. It's in good shape. Thank you, Amanda. And the, this one don't come with a key. It's got a little hole right here where you can hit the latch to open the door up. It's got a little hole right here in the side where you can open the door up. And somebody sent me in about four hundred dollars, and let's go. Give them an unplug it where they can see yeah, it. Yeah, unplug it where they can see it. We showed them it works. Plus, we put about two dollars worth of quarters in it. Now you can see it a lot better, guys. It holds quarters. This one's called the Ghost Rush. I don't know who that is. We, you've got to be registered to be a threshold. You have to be registered to be in. You have got a reserve on it. Yeah, I've got a reserve on it. We do have a reserve on it. Now, I like this one better than the one that sold last night. Oh, Joe, it's got quarters. Just take it over to his house. $400 be able to go 400 $400 be able to go 400 $400 be able to I'm going to have to get me some new moderators. It's 75 cents a span. Hey, Charles, if you, if you 75 cents that, is what it's set on. Yeah. $300 be able to go 300 $300 be able to go 300 What we have? We need to get going. $300 baby to go 300 I don't, I don't, it's not let it's not letting us do it for some reason I may be signed out or something makes Stefanski a moderator I can't for some reason it's not letting me do that Mod, I'll, I'll get in a little bit Stefan all right on the slot machine I don't think we've got no interest on it Charles not on this not. slot machine. You're here, 55. It's going to be a slow go. Yeah. Guys, we're not going to play around and waste time, waste your time, waste my time on this. I've got a reserve on it, and it just will waste 10 or 15 minutes when we could be selling other items. If y'all want to put a serious bid in, we'll go ahead and try to auction. If not, we're going to go ahead and wait. Where's my moderators at? Oh, Amanda was there. Amanda just there she is. somebody done something. Do they not know how to ban them? There's Cynthia. She'll take care of it. Yeah. She took she care of it. Me. All right, got seventy five hundred. Seventy five dollar baby to go hundred. Seventy five dollar baby to go hundred. We'll try to auction it off, guys, but I don't think it'll meet the reserve. I got seventy five dollar baby to go hundred. Seventy five dollar baby to go hundred. Seventy five thank you, Cynthia. Seventy five dollar baby to go hundred. Seventy-five dollar baby to go hundred. Well, Ruth, something's wrong with my laptop's not letting me change anything. I will here in just a little bit. But Dana, it'll only do it on your end if you're not a moderator. Hundred. I got a hundred. Hundred dollar baby to go one fifty. Hundred dollar baby, and we do have a reserve on this, guys. I want you to look at the graphics on this. It's this, not. like I said, this would be great for a man cave. I mean, we can wait a few days, Mark, but I don't think it's going to meet my reserve. Oh, up there's it's hundreds great, all over the house. Great, great graphics here, guys. And like I said, you don't need the key. It's got, they put a little hole in the side where you hit the latch, open the doors. It takes quarters. It can be fixed. And it, yeah, you can put another lock on it easy. You should be at 200 and you're gone. Thank you, Dana. Yeah, we ought to be over 200 easy. And I've, I've got a $100 bid, guys. Hundred dollar be able to go one fifty. Hundred dollar be able to go one fifty. Hundred dollar be able to go one fifty. And I think this was better than one the last night. It brought two seventy five. This one takes quarters. It ain't tough. Thank you, Dana. 
125. I got 125, 150. $125 dollar bid, we go 150, 125. And this is probably worth three to four hundred dollars, I'd say. Easy. I got 150, go 200. 150 dollar bid, we go 200. We're getting close to that reserve. I got 150, would you go 200? 150 dollar bid, would you go 200? 150 dollar bid, I got 135. I've done it 150. Randy, We're going backwards, going backwards, Randall. I got 150. Maybe he probably meant 185, I guess. I got 150. Would you go 200? 150 dollar bid, would you go 200? The one last night brought 275. And I think this one's got better graphics. The one last night didn't take quarters. It took tokens. It took tokens. This one actually takes quarters. You can set it up and uh, don't do nothing illegal because you got a deputy sheriff watching. <laughs> well, he's been known it too. So I got. I got 150. Would you go 175? 150 dollar bid. Would you go 175? 150 dollar bid. Would you go 175? 150 dollar bid. Would you go 175? Yes, it does. Yeah, work, we will. Randall. Yes, it works. He might have just joined us. We plugged it in. It lights up. It there takes quarters. 180. I got 180. 200. Guys were twenty dollars away from the reserve. I'll just go ahead and tell you. I'm at 180, 200, and that's that's probably half of what it's worth. I got 180, 200, 180, and the one that's the top bidder now, if we don't make it over that 200 mark, and I've got the reserve's been met. I've got 200, 225, 200, I'll be able to go 225, 200, and this will be fun, guys, if you sit around your pool table, things like that. I got, and Randall, you must be behind, okay? You are lagging. Yeah, my little screw came out of that, Charles. What? I got 210, 220. 210, would you go 220? And I'd say anywhere they would want four or $500 for this. A working slot machine, I'm only at 210. $210 bid. And Randall, you're probably behind. Party at Mark's. Go Mark. <laughs> I got 210, go 220. And this, like I said, a conversation piece. And once you start playing it, you can't stop playing it. The Your buddies, when they're we it they, they drinking a little bit, they're going to feed it quarters and feed it quarters, and you'll wind up making enough to pay for your beer at your party. Yes, David. And I've got one more that we're going to sell maybe one night this week, and I may keep it for myself. I don't know. But I've got 210, go 220. All right, we're going to start the countdown. I'm waiting on Randall because I think Randall was behind. I got Jeff Sanders at 220. 220, go 230. 220, go 230. 220, go 230. 220, go 230. 220, thank you for bidding, Mark. Are you sure? I've got 220, go 230. And it does work, guys. 220, go 230. $220, everybody go 230. $220 bid, would you go $230? Going once. I got $220 bid. Would you go $230? Going twice. I've got a $220 bid. I'm asking for $230. Guys, you're going to wish you bought this. And I just got $240. $239. Jeff Sanders can't tell me. I got $239 from Randall. Randall and then was behind. I got 239. Randall confirmed that bid. Is that 239? Because I was at 220 with jail. Confirmed that bid because we just about dropped the hammer. Jeff Sanders. I got to wait for Randall or Linda Guffey, whichever one that is. 230. He said 230. Okay. So you can bid 240 now, Jeff. I think it'll scare them to death, and that'll be it. And you'll have it. And I got 230. No, oh, Jeff, Jeff, don't go out. Don't be Jeff. scared, Jeff. It's only 10 more dollars. And she'll let you back in in a couple of days. Yeah, Joe, she'll let you back in. You Where's won't have to Joe? sleep in the police cruiser. I got 230, go 240, going once. I got, Jeff, are you sure? Is everybody sure? Mark, are you sure? I got 230. Would you go 240, going twice? It's got three dollars worth of change in it. Yeah, it's got three dollars worth. I got two hundred thirty dollar bid. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Two forty. Two forty. <laughs> what the heck's that mean? Two forty. I got two forty. Would you go two fifty? They might be counting the change. Jeff's in going it. for. I got two forty. Would you go two fifty? Two forty. Would you go two fifty? This is the hardest money I've ever worked for in my life. 
my back starting to hurt again. I got 240. Would you go 250? 240. Would you go fit 250 going once? I got $240 bid. Would you go 250 going twice? I got 245. We will take $5 increments. <laughs> I got 245. Would you go 250? I got a $245 bill. Would you go 250? <laughs> I got $245 bill. Would you go 250? And I've got the hammer out. I'm fixing to drop this hammer. I got two. Yeah, they're 10. Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. Jeff, there's $10 worth quarters in there. Oh, he's getting fussed at. He's getting fussed at. <laughs> Jeff, didn't you say that you the one that wore the pants a while ago? I think she picked them out, though. <laughs> I, got, I got $245. Would you go 250 going once? I got $245 bid. You're going to wish you had of going twice. I got a $245 bid from Randall Guffey. Third and final call. I want to thank everybody for bidding because we are going to drop the hammer because Jeff ain't going to have time to bid. Oh, he did. Oh, gosh. He came in there bid 250. Jeff sleeping in the doghouse tonight. I got 250. Would you, Randall? Randall, I'll just get mad and hit it for 300. That's the way Randall is. He may knock him out for sure. I got 250. Asked him for 260. Going once. I got a two hundred fifty dollar bid. I'm asking for oh, two sixty. Second call. I got a two hundred fifty dollar bid. He's out. Are you sure? He's out. Is Linda fussing at you, Randall? <laughs> oh, where's the pants? We've got. We've got. We can open up our store up there and let y'all come up there and sleep. <laughs> and we have sold it. Sold it. Sold it. Sold it. Sold it. That's a goodbye there. Goodbye. What did bring? Lord, I, I feel like it should have brought like a thousand dollars. All that work. That was some hard work. That was that's a good buy. Jeff, you made me work so hard. I'm thinking I'd go take a nap. It was. That's a good buy. That's a good buy. All right, we'll have another one, guys, tomorrow night or the next night, one of the nights that we're having our sale this week, okay? Y'all worked me so hard. Congratulate Jeff and thank you, Randall, for bidding. Thank you, Mark, for bidding. Uh just appreciate everybody that bid on that item. Y'all make the auction what it is today. Yeah. All right. Sell a zip, get a zip code reel there, Ricky. This yeah, is you stand my house right there. Zip code 33. Right there it is. It's a newer model. <laughs> this ain't an old one. It's a newer model. It's got a bigger handle on it. Got a $5 bill. I said that won't be broke. Stefanski. $10 from Randy Maynard. What is that? Zip code 33. It is a good one. Oh, is it 33? Yep. I feel like I'm a fishing. Asking for twelve fifty. We got ten from Randy Maynard. Asking twelve fifty. Brandy, I'm selling that to you. So ten fifty or ten dollars. Ten dollars. Jeff said leave those quarters in there, Jerry. What are you gonna sell? Check this out. That's the only thing he's gonna let Joni play with. Whammo. Birdie golf. Check that out. You got your little, you get your little club. You get the birdies. Hey, we may have some yard darts on the truck, they said. Yeah, we got two sets. Two sets of the illegal yard darts? Yeah. Oh, this is gold. Yeah. Wow. It's cool. Uh, Jerry, a couple days, you can buy, a couple weeks, you can buy it back. What? Joni said it'll probably be for sale in a couple weeks. It's right here. <laughs> That's funny. Somebody started me in at $10 on this. This would be fun for the kids. Yeah, we'll have to get to them. Hey, guys. 
You talking about a, a man cave item that's coming up next, Joni? Oh, you may yeah. have something else to fuss about. Yeah, you fix them. They fuss. Yeah, because it's gorgeous. What's coming up next? Is. I got two and a half from Ruth. Two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. Good, safe way to play golf in your backyard. I got two and a half looking for three. I got three that's looking for four. Got tied in at three. I got three looking for three dollars. You got five from Ruth. Whammo. I remember those commercials. Whammo. Hello, Kathy. My cousin. Because I got five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. Got Ruth in at five. I got five looking for six. I got five looking for six. You taking it apart? Oh, okay. I got five looking for six. I got six looking for seven. Got six dollars looking for seven. There's a date on the bottom of that, Jerry. 2013. I got six looking for seven. Six dollars looking for seven. Six looking for seven. So to Todd Payne for six dollars. Come in. Including him. Here you go, Charles. This is a nice item right here. From the hunter. Oh, we got him. Brand new. Brand new. Tree stand skirt. Brand new. Tree stand skirt. They were like $400, Ricky. Yeah, that? Yeah. I've never actually used one myself. Yeah. That's me right there. That's. That's my. That's the tree stands I'm used to. Jack Daniels. No, it's got a. Yep, that's tree stand skirt. Right here. Now I got five from Todd. Five looking for six. Five looking for six. Y'all can look these up. These are a tree stand skirt. I'm at five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. Five looking for six. I'm at five. Look, got six. Got six. Looking for seven. Got Becky Taylor at six first. I got six. Looking for seven. Six dollars. Looking for seven. Right around four hundred bucks or high. Mm -hmm. Just because it's got that on it. I've never seen one with that on it. I got six. Oh. Looking for seven. Six. Yeah, looking for seven. People makes a little table. I'm at nine. I got Sandy in at nine. It says I'm at nine looking for ten. What is that a tree stand skirt? Yeah, I've never used one. Urban, I'm at nine looking for ten. Got Sandy Boardman in at nine. I got Sandy, you're in at nine. Got nine looking for ten. Nine dollars looking for ten. Oh, now I got ten. Got Todd Payne in at ten. Looking for twelve and a half now. Ten looking for twelve and a half. Oh, I got that. ten. I Somebody know. go twelve and a half. I got Sandy. You know the. You know it's got to be two and a half increments after ten. Got one ring that's not on it. Yeah. Sandy, thank you, Sandy. I got twelve and a half looking for fifteen. Twelve and a half looking for fifteen. I got twelve and a half. Somebody go fifteen. I got twelve and a half looking for fifteen. Twelve and a half looking for fifteen. No, LSU's ahead. <laughs> 12 and a half, 15. Yeah. So that 12 and a half, Sandy Boardman. All right, raise your sights, you cave people. Looky here, guys. What we've got. Whiskey barrel. There's what's on the top of it. Kentucky bourbon. It's got the horse on it. The whiskey barrel. It is a real whiskey barrel, guys. You talking about it? One band is gone. Is the only thing I see that's and it's super heavy. It's heavy. It is a real Kentucky bourbon whiskey barrel or bourbon barrel. It's dated on the bottom. It's not full. No, it's not full, guys. These things are going three and four hundred dollars. They can look them up. You can look them up. He needs that to put his slot machine on. You're right. Yeah. Stay on put the top, Kentucky. Kentucky Bourbon Barrel Ale. Look at that. Yeah. 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 
they're going for three and four hundred dollars easy, and that's on eBay. Uh, Joni, go outside and check the mail. <laughs> Got a fifty dollar bed. It's nice. It's pretty. Hunter, Jeff Sanders. Yeah, they're bringing. They're bringing. I just looked them up. I, I'm curious. Sometimes I hadn't had a chance to look us up. Three and four hundred dollars. Hundred five. So Jeff wants that next to his poker machine. He's, he's gonna, gonna set it right he's on. He's gonna set a slot machine right on it. It'll fit right on. <laughs> in his man cave over there. He'll get in trouble this time. Ah. <laughs> This is the real deal, guys. And I'm at 105 with Andrew Garrison Miller. Oh. Thank you, Shelly, and y'all for updating me. <laughs> I think I'm fixing it. a long day. Let him go out. Sick, Jerry? Uh -huh. That feel much. It makes it sick. <laughs> huh? <laughs> he took a something for his back hurt. Your back is killing me. <clears throat> Glad Becky. Yeah. She don't go shut that door. She hit it. She'd be right going. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking about people in here if they start coming back like down. They're <laughs> gagging. <laughs> Nope. We're coming back. Sleep. She tell me ten o'clock when we get that truck to come over here. They're coming back, Jerry. I'm gonna have to go out there and get some Oh, we're going to the house already. I'll go out here. Okay. Well, Are they coming back? Yeah. Yeah. Here, we're getting some messages. I don't know if somebody's trying to message. We got Andrew, Andrew Miller at 105. There's a Tony E suggestion. You might have to go in both Mr. and the messages. Yeah. Go UK. I'll get it. What the? Or up by two. Thank you, Cynthia. Uh, guys, we've not sold the barrel. It started buffering on us. It's probably too hot. We're going to have to move away from that heater. I'm, I'm going to redo it. Once we get all that over there, I'm going to redo it again. Mm -hmm. I don't know, Angela. Cornell, we all feel. been a long week already. <clears throat> now, LSU, man. It's going to be a slug fest there at the end. Now ain't going to get no easier. They got Tennessee, number one, coming up Saturday. Yeah. They bid down there, Jerry. Uh, they're just now coming back. All right, guys, we're at the whiskey barrel here, bourbon barrel. Got the nice design on top of it. Nice barrel right here, guys. And we got Andrew Garrison Miller. Is in at 105, and these things are going three and four hundred dollars, guys. It's not a nice. And then you, though. then they have to pay shipping mm -hmm. on top of that, and that thing would be high price to it. ship. Ain't nobody just gonna pick that up. Is everybody back? Andrew Garrison, and we had uh, Jeff Sanders bidding on this, and maybe some new blood. Or we're, him we're at 105. <laughs> Joni's done knock Jeff out. <laughs> Joni's saying, Joni <laughs> saying, sell it. Jeff's Jeff's out. Out. Oh, they had a conversation while they were. That buffering out. messed me up, Jeff. <laughs> yeah. That buffering messed me up. Yeah. All right, guys, this is cheap for this. It is. I mean, I've sold the little small ones for that price, but we're gonna go with it. I didn't put a reserve on it. I don't even. So I'm gonna that. start auctioning. Okay, if everybody's back. On the whiskey barrel, I'll show it to you again for those that's just getting back. The top, what it says on it, it's got your horse and stuff. I love this right here, the way this is. I'm at $105 B would you go 110. I got $105 B would you 110 on the whiskey barrel. The original real deal right here, guys. I'm at $105. This will be the bargain of the night if it holds at that price. 
I'm at one five. Would you go one ten? Hundred five dollar bid, and that's cheap for that. Hundred five dollar bid, would you go one ten? Hundred five dollar bid, would you go one ten? Oh my goodness, hundred five dollar bid. L well, yeah, beer, 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 beer barrel, L, whatever you want to call it. There, it's the same size as the big whiskey barrel. They Kentucky they Bourbon use all they use it. all the same barrels. Kentucky Bourbon made it. It's their beer. And I'm at one five. Would you go one ten? I think everybody's back. I got one five, one ten going once. And that's going to be cheap for this. I got a $105 bid. I'm asking for one ten on the whiskey barrel. Yes, it's a great deal. I'm asking one ten for the second time. Yes. I got a, yeah, yeah 50, 50 some gallon. gallon. I got a $105 bid from Andrew Garrison Miller. I'm asking for one ten. Cheap, cheap, cheap all day long. And this is the third and final call. Is everybody done? I can't believe I'm going to sell this. I thought for sure that'd bring over $200, $300. But we are going to sell it. Andrea Garrison Miller, what a buy. Congratulations, Andrea. That was a good buy. Jeff, I can't believe you let Joni run all over you like that. I thought you was more than a man than that. Great, no, I'm great. kidding. I'm kidding. The yeah, they make bar. coffee tables out of that. They make uh, little bars out of that and everything. Mm -hmm. You guys might sell. Um, you're welcome, Andrea. She had him by the ear. She had him by the ear, pulling on yeah. that ear of his. I'm going to sell an old toy right here, guys. Sell an old toy. Space, 1999. It is die cast. Die cast in plastic. Oh, we we sell an iPhone. Nope. No. It's old space 1999 die cast. That's plastic, plastic frame. These are die cast. The main frame underneath the die cast. That's die cast and that's die cast. Charles, that's a high price piece you're selling there. Yeah. And we got us. And I got two and a half from Amanda. Give you all a chance to look up what Space 1999 Eagles are selling for. I had the big one. The big white one? Yeah. Yeah. You can take the front off of it and use it. Yeah. Yeah, I remember those. I bet five from Peter. Five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. The, the figures and all the doctors. I don't know. And it still it comes on every day too. I watch it when I get a chance. Classic sixty sci-fi. Bruce said you got a china cabinet. I bet five looking for six. Uh, five I'm looking for six. Sure. Five looking for six. Oh, wow, Sold that to Peter for five dollars. You go, Ricky. Or Hey, let Ricky sell it. Where'd Barlow you... knife. Barlow knife. Got a Barlow. It's older. R Ruth, I've Too got. Blade. I don't know for sure yet. Got a little bit of stuff on the blade. It could be claimed. Could be. It's not scratched all the pieces. I got a ten dollar bid from Randy Maynard asking for twelve fifty. Oh, it's got something like tape on it up here or something. Asking twelve fifty, got ten from Randy Maynard. I believe we fix and sell this knife. What? Yeah, we fix and sell it for ten bucks. For ten dollars. What? Somebody gonna give me twelve fifty <laughs> on a Barlow knife? Randy said, "Sell it." <laughs> Randy says he needs another bargain. I'm gonna close it. Somebody gonna give me twelve fifty? About to close the twelve fifty. Drew Lindsay, ain't know that I was being serious. I was fixing to sell it, mm -hmm. asking fifteen dollars. No, 
Need fifteen dollars on a barlow. Older knife. Asking fifteen dollars. Randy, are you out? Randy's out. You sure, Randy? Asking fifteen dollars. We're gonna sell it. So picture barrel Ricky. We got a pitcher barrel here. It's glazed. It says 2508 on the bottom, number two. Got a little place on it right here. Jerry likes to show everybody the imperfection on anything that he sells. That right there is the only thing I see. It's a little fleet bites, what he calls them. I'm just use his language what he's teaching made? me is there anything about where it's made at on the it bottom? doesn't no, say where it's got made. a it's just got a number on the bottom somebody gonna start me out it don't say where it's made it says 2508 number there you go there's just some bits number two three dollars yeah it's probably a half a gallon. Three dollar bid, asking for four. It's pretty. That got five dollars. Got a little. That's the only thing wrong with it, right there. I'm not sure who that is. We got a five dollar bid, asking for six. It is pretty, y'all. It's clean. Yes, There's the bottom of it. And it is glazed. Tie ball game. Five seconds to go. Five dollar bid asking for six. She is Joan. Joan, you registered? They said he they were. Joan has been here before, but I do not see Joan in here. Joan, are you registered? I'm thinking I've been to the in-house before. It's over. They won. Yeah. LSU won. LSU. They're on score. They, I bet they filed them and they hit the free throw. Yeah. 73-71. She said she's supposed to be. Okay. okay. I'm going to sell it to you. Sell it. So, guys, go, go, Power Rangers. I don't even know what Look at this. name it would be. Because Joan's been to the in-house. Joan, what's your name? What will it be under here? Yeah, she's been to the in-house. Joan. Before. What will your name be on the uh, what was ticket? Under? What was you registered under? Easy, Ronald. <laughs> Somebody needs to block Brad 2000 XP. They just did. Cindy. Of course, she would resend her information. Joan, can you resend your information to us? Linda King's sister. Put it on. Okay, yeah, that's good. But Power Rangers, right here. The ones can just. There you go. I'm at five dollars for Peter. Five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. I'm at five looking for six. I'm at five looking for six. Got Peter in at five. I got five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. I got five looking for six. Got six looking for seven. I got six looking for seven. I got six looking for seven. I got six looking for seven. Six dollars looking for seven. Got six looking for seven. Got six looking for seven. Sold it. To yeah, you got it, Joan. Uh, 
Yes. Yep. All right, guys. This is a miniature poker. I'm not even opening this up. Oh, it's a little miniature poker thing. Look at those little small chips. Isn't that cool? Charles, we got a deck of cards over we can put in this. There's the dealer chip. I'm sure I can find a deck of cards somewhere. These are small chips, little Angel miniature cards. chips. I got Chris Angel cards. Uh, yeah, that'd be Peter said he bid seven on it, but I didn't see his bid. On what? That what you was just selling. Uh Peter, you got it at five. Or didn't you? No. No. Six. Linda King no, got it. I'd already sold it when that popped up. Linda King got it, didn't she? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah that Thomas popped Brown up. On, uh, they got a lag, I guess. Yeah, sorry about that, Peter. It was it was too late. Yeah, Mark said he was And we got seven and a half on the little miniature poker thing, and uh they're gonna put a set of Chris Angel cards in here for you. Chris Angel. Little carrying thing. I got seven and a half from Ruth Rice on the little poker. It's me. Yes, Jeff, you can. Sorry about that, Peter. Please, by all means, come and get it. <laughs> I got 10 from John. Yeah, come on, Jeff. I got to get my quarters out first, Jeff. <laughs> we got John uh, McCormick in at $10. Need tw I got 12 and a half from Ruth Rice. Pretty neat little deal here, them little miniature chips. I've never seen them that small. Mm. <laughs> oh, and sold that to Roof Rice for 12 and a half. Guys, now I found this silver dollar from the year you were born, 2001. And this is exactly the way I found this uh, silver dollar. This is a silver dollar. United States of America, one ounce of fine silver, one dollar. It's a 2001, it said on it. And this is one that's got the eagle on the back of it. And that right there is just, uh, that just needs cleaning. I'm not going to bother cleaning it. That's an ounce of silver, guys. One ounce of fine silver. That's solid silver, guys. And it does need cleaning. I'm not going to try to clean it because uh, it looks like it's in really good shape and not worn or anything. One ounce of fine silver, and it's got the eagle on the back, the American eagle. One ounce of fine silver, 2001. And I got Stefan in at twenty dollars. I got twenty-two and a half from uh, Gloria Mad Dog Maddox. Charles, I'm gonna leave it in this too. It shows a little providence there. Yeah. Guys, we got some mini fridges too. It's coming up, and I'm gonna try to do a little. Uh, I've got a. I do have a. That is a china cabinet, isn't it? Yeah, Ruth. I think I may have a china cabinet for you. I got twenty-five, need twenty-seven and a half on the one ounce of silver, two thousand one coin. There, pretty nice coin. Like I said, it needs cleaning. Looks like they spilled something on it or something there. Oh, ten was on the Power Ranger. That's a lag, man. Way. So I've got a back. What did I sell out the roof rice for? Ruth Rice got the, the chips. Got the poker chips for twelve fifty. Uh, and 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 who had bid? So I've got to back that up to uh, 
seven fifty for Roof Rice. On the poker chips. On the poker chips. Roof, I'm backing that up because he wasn't bidding on them. I'm backing them up to seven fifty because ten was his last bid. Gloria, she won this coin. I've got, who have I got in there? Glory Maddox at 25? Yeah. All right, Randy, I got $25. Sold it. 25 to Gloria Mad Dog Maddox. And we have a nice watch right here. This is a, where's my other magnifying glass? This is Geneva Quartz. Still has the sticker on the back. It still has the, the sticker there on the back of it there. Oh, yeah. She won that. Uh, I didn't see that. Gloria was in at twenty-two fifty, and she beat Randy, and she came back and bid again. So Gloria's supposed to be twenty-two and a half. And a half. Thanks, Randy. Thanks for losing me two dollars and a half <laughs> on this nice-looking watch right here, guys. I guess it's brand new because it's got the sticker on the back. Remember, everybody, Valentine's is Thursday. That's great gift. I got a $3 starting bid on it. How much? I know I would, Randy. <laughs> that is a really nice looking watch, too. Yeah. I just never wear a watch. There's the sticker still on the back. I told you to hold that up. I'm not yeah. feeling real good. Jerry, your boat's over here. I might need to get something in my stomach. I think it's someone on the bottom. I got five looking for six. Five looking for six. Got at least some better in it. Five. I got five looking for six. I got five looking for six. Got at least some better at five. Five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. Five looking for six. Got five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. I got five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. Five looking for six. I guess we're done. So Lisa Matter, five bucks. Big heavy nice glass bowl there, Charles. Let me try to get a little something in my stomach. Mm -hmm. Happy, hey, that was Steve's Valentine's present. <laughs> Look at this, guys. Nice bowl. I don't see any flea bites, cracks, anything in it. Get the camera turned up. Big fruit bowl. I ain't gonna be able to do that right now. <laughs> Get you some crackers. Yeah. Anybody interested in this big fruit bowl? That's a nice one, Charles. Mm hmm. It's glass. I got three from Lisa. Three looking four. Three dollars looking four. I got three looking four. I got Lisa Payne in at four. Lisa Matters out. And at four looking five. Four dollars looking five. That'll get some beards there. Yeah. Four looking five. I'm at Lisa Payne at four. I'm at four looking five. Four dollars looking five. Four looking five. Four dollars looking for five. That to Lisa Payne for four dollars. That was cheap. 
Look at this. Is that crystal? Yeah, that is heavy duty. Heavy crystal. Did y'all see the bottom? You sell that pan, Ricky? No. No. He'd be selling. Look at this. Rolling house, Jerry. I'm at 10 when Robin. 10 looking for 12 and a half. 10 looking for 12 and a half. I'm with Robin at 10. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. $10 looking for 12 and a half. 10 looking for 12 and a half. Smooth. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. $10. Look. It is good looking. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. We got Robin in at 10. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. I wonder if Angry is working. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. Angry. She's probably over there. She wasn't called out. Yep. I'm at 10 looking for 12 and a half. 10 looking for 12 and a half. $10 looking for 12 and a half. 12 and a half. 12 and a half. Kathy Graham. Kathy, where's it at? There it is. Well, she got 13. I'm at 15 with Robin. I'm at 15 looking for 17 and a half. I'm at 15 looking for 17 and a half. I'm at 15 looking for 17 and a half. They're getting some of the feed before we do. Yep. I'm at 15 looking for 17 and a half. 15 looking for 17 and a half. Got 17 and a half looking for 20. Got 17 and a half looking for 20. You got 17 and a half looking for 20. Robin, you're out. Robin says she's out. I got 17 and a half looking for 20. 17 and a half looking for 20. 17 and a half looking for 20. So that's Kathy Grant for 17 and a half. We got a big skillet, Charles. We'll sell it. No, eat my dinner. <laughs> We call this uh, cuisine mark. Big pan. You gotta make her laugh. Huh? You gotta make her laugh. Look at here. Fifteen inches. That's a big pan right there. Metal handle. Um. <laughs> I wiped it out. That was all. Got to handle it this this thing, and I guess where you get the foot in there, it's a heavy. <laughs> there it is. What Kathy buy that base? I got a crystal I got a ten dollar bid asking twelve fifty. Twelve fifty asking fifteen. This is nice. Fifteen, Ruth. You got it for fifteen. Asking seventeen fifty. It says cuisine mark. No, it says cuisine art. Stainless steel. Cuisine art. Huh? Yeah. Cuisine art. Is that what you call it? Cuisine art's what they say. Fifteen asking seventeen and a half. Ruth, you've got it at this point. If nobody else bids, but this is a high price skillet. Asking seventeen and a half. Becky, Ruth's got it at 15. Becky, Becky's in there at 17 and a half, asking 20. Ruth's in there at 20, asking 2250. Rebecca, are you out? Everybody out? Back is out. I'm gonna sell it. 
It's what Jerry does. <laughs> oh, Ruth Rice. I'm going to make them jump off the couch. <laughs> so Linus and Charlie. Linus and Charlie Brown. Squeaky toys. Who's going to start me out here? This is the one that stinks all the time. Dang. Yeah, this one does. Uh -uh. Yeah, he does. That's, that's pig pen. Is it pig pen that stinks? Mm -hmm. I'm wrong. <laughs> 250. I think he's Asking for three. Three. Asking for four. Squeaky toys. Four. Asking for five. No, they said that's pig pen too, Charles. They know more than I do. But I've watched it. <laughs> Five dollars. Becky Swagger. Somebody give me six. Is this collectible? Everybody out? You have five dollars asking for six. Is the dog looking at the screen? I think she's going crazy. I was trying to figure out whose dog would be looking for him. Yeah. They run around the couch for What do you got on them? Five dollars. Asking for six. That's cheap. Three dollars a piece. Yeah. Need six dollars. There it is. Going for the hammer. So, five dollars. Becca Swagger. If you don't let anything you find something else. This hell is. Let's see what this is. Anytime you got a picture. I can't even say what it says in it. Nothing. It's a picture. Okay. Set a gallon, Charles. Half gallon. Mm -hmm. Half gallon pitcher. Somebody start me out on this. It's got no no cracks, no flea bites, nothing. Perfect. Somebody start me out anywhere you want to. It's y'all's auction. Three dollars from Les Colado. Let me see that. See that Asking for four. Bottle? No. Nothing. Yeah, it's got, somebody wrote on the bottom of it with a paint marker or something. Three dollars asking for four. I don't know what it is about me trying to auction. I done pretty decent last night and then tonight they just oh there it is. Four dollars asking five. Asking five. I think it's a little bit of a lag tonight. Mm -hmm. Uncle Jed ain't feeling well, we ain't uh, jumping around in here. He gets us good, he gets us turned on out here. You know how y'all y'all lock away wow. eggs. He gets us all excited. Asking five dollars on this. I got a four dollar bid. Four dollars. I'm gonna sell it. Here I am. No, oh. Robin. Yep. What can I find? <laughs> Here about this. I don't know if this is what you. What well, I got a cheese slicer on this though. Uh, cheese. 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 I got some melted bottles. They're bottles. I don't know what they are. They just melted old bottles to me. Melted. melted bottles. They saying it's a. Well, it's got a cheese slicer on it, but I don't know what this would be used for. To put your cheese crackers, on. Crackers. 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 Chips. Cheese, and they're made out of old wine bottles. Somebody start me out on these melted bottles with a little decoration on them. They say it's a cheese slicer. Somebody start me out. Somewhere. 250. Come on. Anywhere. 250. 
Somebody said ashtrays. No. I got a three dollar bid. Somebody give me four. Christy Carter bid on them. She has to be saving up for a wedding, I think. Yeah, she's fixing to get married, I reckon. Christy Carter. You gonna be a Jenkins, Christy? <laughs> Ain't that Ain't that neat? I got a three dollar bid asking for four. Charles, you know what that says? Cheese grater, green and clear wine. Here it is. Yeah. Twyla Martin. She wants the melted bottles with the cheese cutter on it. So. Twyla. I'm gonna let you sell something. Don't let me sell something. No money. You ain't making no money. No, I ain't good at this stuff. Well, I'm gonna try and find something to sell. Here, watch it. See it. You can't pull it, you know. Here we go. What's that lady? They getting in on these cheap buys, getting in this bucket over here for the mm -hmm. drawing we're going to have at the end. Look here. All y'all's numbers is going in this one right here. Look here, guys. Episode one, Star Wars, Anakin Watch with a lightsaber holder. Episode one. Got Anakin Skywalker. I'm at five dollars. Five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. I got five looking for six. I got Mark in at five. I got five looking for six. Never been opened. Still sealed. <clears throat> I got six from Gloria. Six looking for seven. Six looking for seven. I got seven looking for eight. I got seven looking for eight. I got seven looking for eight. Got them working at seven. Yeah. I got seven looking for eight. Seven dollars looking for eight. I got seven looking for eight. Seven dollars looking for eight. I got seven looking for eight. Eight. Eight looking for nine. Eight dollars looking for nine. Got Lord Gloria in it. I don't know. Got nine, nine looking for ten, nine dollars looking for ten. Got nine looking for ten. I got nine dollars looking for ten, nine looking for ten. I got nine looking for ten. I got nine looking for ten, nine dollars looking for ten, nine looking for ten. Sold that mark for nine dollars. Your turn. <laughs> we got some canister set here. Pretty nice. Mainstays. They are black in color. There's three of them. They all have the spoons. Pretty nice set. See through lids. Where you can see what's down in them. I got a 250 bid asking for three or more. Three dollars, Barbara, asking four. They're nice. Four dollars, asking for five. Four dollars all over the place. Somebody give me five dollars. Five. Need six. That, uh, Somebody give me six dollars. They nice. Going all night. <laughs> I've heard rumor you. You know, I, I personally know those back seats aren't comfortable when you put some. I don't know where the measuring tape is. Those ones are not bad. <laughs> okay. Huh? 
that one's eight inches tall, four inches wide. That one's seven. That one's six. Six, seven, eight. I got a six dollar bid asking for seven. Black, yes. Seven, asking for eight. They are nice. None of them's got chips, cracks. Ten. Need twelve fish. They worth it, guys. Got ten asking twelve fifty. Got ten asking for twelve fifty. Barbara, are you out? Corey? I'm gonna sell it. Somebody give me twelve fifty. I'm gonna sell it. So they said sell it. BJ. BJ got those? Yep. Okay, guys, got another episode one Tatooine accessory set. It's another Star Wars from episode one. <laughs> Got the accessory set. So if any of your little ones still have any of the uh, Star Wars and get this, keep it, not open it. And this is Star Wars Episode 1 Tatooine accessory set. Still packaged, still good to go. You don't see these as much as you do the action figures. And I'm at two and a half with Becky. I'm at seven with Bradley Thin. I'm at seven looking for eight. Seven dollars looking for eight. I'm at seven looking for eight. I'm at seven looking for eight. You have, do we have Bradley Thin? I'll come see what lets you buy that bar. I'm at seven looking for eight. Guys, let me know if y'all, Bradley, are you a regular? No, we do not have a Bradley 10. Is that his real name? Bradley, is that your real name? I don't know who that is. If not, I'm going all the way back to Rebecca. Oh, Rebecca, see? Keeps buffering and things. Hey, Ricky, take Charles's place for a second. How much was it, Charles? Uh, two and a half. Two and a half. We ain't playing with these fellas. We want to joke around on here. Run oh, stuff up. We don't know who they are. This is a family business. Our young people watching this. Got a 250 bed asking for three. <laughs> Somebody give me three dollars. <laughs> Accessory kit. Who got this for two and a half? Uh, Rebecca. Rebecca, you own it. It's uh, something else. Mm -hmm. Somebody wanted these. Well, sell it to them. These mugs, and I think they wanted this too. Let's pull it to It's got money in it. I want to sell both of them, all three cases. Somebody wanted these today. I'm going to put them up here and hope they're watching. Two cups and a creamer thing. No chips, no cracks. Somebody start me out. Five dollars asking for six. Six asking for seven. 
They are glazed pottery. Ten. Asking for twelve fifty. John likes them. Somebody give me twelve fifty. Or John's fixing on them. We ain't playing tonight. James said burp. Are you eating, James? Asking twelve fifty. Y'all lagging. <laughs> so, John Morrell. John Morrell. I wake y'all up, don't I? Keep you on your toes. Freedom! <laughs> I'm selling a sign. <laughs> Freedom! <laughs> yeah, two coffee cups, glazed creamer. I'm at they're glazed three from from Barbara Graves. Three looking four. Three dollars looking four. I'm at three looking four. I'm at three dollars looking four. I'm at four looking five. Got Adam in at four. I'm at four looking five. Four dollars looking five. I'm at four looking five. Got Adam in at four. I got four dollars looking five. I got four looking five. I got five from Lisa. Five looking for six. I'm at five looking for six. I got Lisa Metter in. I got six looking at Adam. I got six looking for seven. I got six looking for seven. I got six looking for seven. I'm at six looking for seven. Six dollar got seven. Pot. I'm at six looking for seven. Cindy James, thank you. I'm at to block whoever uh, Chin Word King is that says he eats kids. They got him. And I'm going to sell that to Adam for $6. Adam Hamilton. Cream and sugar dish right here. It is pretty. I like a design on it. It's stainless. Y'all start me out here. Yeah, It's probably for coffee or tea or something. <laughs> Somebody start me out. It's pretty. Uh, no. Who's that peer column or whatever? Is there a name on the bottom of that? <laughs> Oh Lord! You can't see with that. Get behind you. Cassidy, custom. Cassidy, custom. Four dollar bid on it. Need five dollars. Surely it's worth five dollars. It's pretty. Somebody give me five dollars on it. I've got a four dollar bid. No, it's not silver. I got a five dollar bid. It's a stainless, but it is pretty. Jody says she's buffering. Go out and come back in. You'll get behind. Asking for six. Everybody's getting black screens, Charles. I just, they got to go back in. They just go out and come back, back in. Having a, having 
I've got a five dollar bid from John Morrell. I'm gonna sell it. So five dollars, John Morrell. What you sell? That. Oh, put it up. I'm gonna sell it's something. Dying. My turn. <laughs> We're gonna clear off this table a little bit, guys. I've got a plastic Hot Wheel Coca Cola semi truck right there. It's plastic Coca Cola semi truck. We don't have the car for the back of it, but you can put about any car on it. Let me fix that wheel real quick. Here we go. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola semi-truck. Right there. Hi, sweetie. Hope you enjoy that, Johnny. <laughs> we'll just see how well it works. I got two and a half from Edna. Two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. I got two and a half looking for three. Thank you, Stevon. I couldn't remember if it was a. Uh... And then I see uh, we didn't have the helicopter. I'm not sure if the person in the unit actually had it or if it got broke and got tossed. But well, I'm at two and a half with Edna Brown. I'm at two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. It was not in the box when that, I took it out. I'm at two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. Sold that to Edna Brown for two and a half. Be right back. <laughs> As, as Uncle Jed says, where'd all the help go? <laughs> they, uh, their bills, their bills. <laughs> I think it's just you two, Gail Carver, because mine's gone out and I'm just running off my regular cell phone service. None shall pass. <laughs> Got a little wizard here. He's got his globe, he's got his staff with a dragon head. This is uh it's uh like a chalk type wizard right here. He stands seven inches tall to the top of his hat. Merlin. And I am right now with Ruth Rice at five dollars. I'm at five looking for six. Five looking for six. I'm at five looking for six. I'm at five dollars looking for six. Ricky, that was a return. It didn't work. I'm at five looking for six. I'm at five dollars looking for six. I'm at five looking for six. Five dollars looking for six. Five looking for six. Six looking for seven. Six looking for seven. <laughs> six looking for seven. I got six with uh, Kathy Gillock. I got six looking for seven. Six looking for seven. Six dollars looking for seven. Kathy Gillock. Tag out. <laughs> Here we got a. It says uh, Michael Chirello's Panini Grill. Uh, India said they were keeping that. Oh. That, that was quick. He told me to sell he some stuff from over there. Last night they were keeping that. I don't see them in here. I don't see them in here. <laughs> I'm not saying you old silver or panini maker. I don't hear nothing. I see nothing. I see nothing. Especially when I heard her say that. Okay, I got a. I found something right here. Set of scope mounts. <laughs> Are you going to keep these? No. I think this is for a 
I think it's for a BB gun, y'all. Pellet rifle. They're silver. They got a small mountain point here. That's what I, I figured they was for a, yeah, they for a BB gun. Somebody won't start me out $250 or $3 on these. They are metal. Charles. Your little boy or something got a yeah. baby gun or a pellet rifle. They're in the box. They are new. Somebody give me 250 No, we ain't losing no signal from providers. He's talking about the, the cell phones. That's oh. why we may be having trouble on our cell phones. Jeff Reynolds has given me a 250 bed. Somebody give me three on them. We'll just keep going or I'll sell them. Nolan, we got a 250 bed. We're asking for three. Some of them slagging and stuff. Three dollars from Nolan. Asking for they are brand new. There's the box. They want some stuff that come off the truck. We waiting on the truck. They, they gonna bring some. The they want to unload some of the truck and they gonna bring us some bring us some more stuff from the truck. We have got some stuff we've been selling y'all from the truck, but we're still waiting. And I got Nolan in it three dollars on these. And they will work on baby gun or pellet rifle with the small mounting piece up here. And I'm fixing to sell it. I'm going to put it in a box. I'm selling these to Nolan. $3. Oh, Lord. Guys, we got a, a mess. Yeah. <laughs> now we got a big refrigerator coming, and it is, it's nice. A mini fridge. Celius. Let me put this up here. It's, I didn't break it. <laughs> I'm not sure. Had y'all in the floor for a minute. Let me get it fixed up here. Okay. It's a 2.8 cubic foot refrigerator. No cool. By Hauser. We haven't cleaned it out or anything. It's got a Stainless steel front, it looks like to me, and black. It doesn't have a freeze part in it, but it is just the refrigerator, and it has got a top and bottom double fanned, so it's a good one. And you can adjust the shelf to any height. Somebody start me out here. Surely it's worth more than five dollars, Vicky. Come on. Somebody give me a $20 bill and start there. I got a 10 all over the house. I got a $25 bid from John Morrell. He knows. He knows what it's worth. Joe Mobley. Joe Mobley, I'm sorry. Which is Harry. Harry. Yeah, it's Harry. Harry's got it. $30, 30 from Vicky Long. It's worth something, y'all. It's it's nice. It's not heavy. It's lightweight. Charles says it wasn't too heavy. It was lightweight. 35 asking surely it's worth 40 dollars y'all i'm gonna ask 40 dollars 35 asking for 40. Right there. i thought there was a little small black one. Oh, where is 35 asking for 40 or 37.50 it's y'all's auction 40 dollars asking 50 or 37.50 or 40 or 42.50 i'm getting confused yeah, open it up and let them see it I've been showing them inside. Yeah. It's all adjustable. You can put anything in it. You can adjust it any which way. Down here. Great for man cave. You need something big in there, you can drop it down, put it in there. Yeah. 
$45. We got a $45 bid. We'll take that. Man cave special right there. It's a nice one. It is nice. It's one of the nicest ones I've seen. I don't think I realize seen. how tall it is. It I can is. tell you. How tall is that? Yeah. Two foot, three and a half. Window. Forty-seven fifty. It's got two spots in the door that you can put stuff. Also, bottom and top. Forty-seven masking fifty. It looks practically brand new. It's got the sticker on it. It's not too old. We have got fifty dollars out of the cheaper ones, but we'll take fifty. Mm -hmm. All right, we got forty-seven asking for fifty. If ain't nobody lagging, we fixing to sell it. Vicky, are you out or Joe? Out, Vicky's out. Joe, are you out? Harry, probably. Or Harry, I don't know y'all by these nicknames. Uh, He's just on Joe's. <laughs> Is he thinking about it? He may be. Harry, you thinking about it? And he may have a lag. He does sometimes. They said Harry might have a lag. Rebecca's say? saying sell it. Um. Jeff's wanting to know what it was. It's a new cool by Hauser. It looks practically brand new. I don't see anything wrong with it. It's a mini fridge. It's a mini fridge. It's got dual fans instead of having the single fan in it. It's dual fanned. Hi, Bradley. Looks like Harry's out. I'm selling it. So, 4750. Wendell. Wendell, 4750. Gone, y'all. You sell the prettiest purse in the house. Er, Charles <laughs> said, This is the prettiest purse, all you little girls. We're going to sell something for the little girls. Uh -uh, I done sold uh -uh, the house. Uh -uh. uh uh. What do you uh -uh. mean? That goes in the house. Who, who said it goes in the house? Ah, uh, Ruby. <laughs> well, let me say you something else. We can't sell that. Ruby's the one put it on the table. 1937 D. <laughs> no. 1937 dime. D. Say 1250, Randy. Randy might have it at twelve fifty. Randy, did you mean twelve fifty? Yeah. yeah. Randy's got it at twelve fifty. We're asking fifteen. Nineteen thirty-seven. Nineteen thirty-seven D. We can't take the fourteen. It's got to be two fifty increments. It's got to be fifteen dollars. Hey, Gloria, you'll have to go fifteen. Charles. Hmm. There should be a yellow box over there that has um, 15 from Glory. We got to have 17 and a half. Printer paper in it, photo paper in it. Well, you need some? No. We'll it's a nice looking dime. Randy's in. out. Nolan, oh, you I out? She wants. Yeah, Nolan's out. So the Glory Mad Ox, $15. Got a 1944S dime. Florida. Yeah. 1944S. Randy's 1250, asking 15. 1250, asking 15. 1944, got 15. 
Asking 17 and a half, Nolan. Gloria's got it at 15. Randy's out. Nolan, you out. Nolan's out. Sold to Gloria for $15. I can't remember who got this. I think Nolan did. Yep. Let me see. What we got? I thought Gloria got that. Gloria? Gloria got it. Yeah, Gloria got she the dime. Was in before no one. Gloria, that's what I'm, I told Charles, right? What about this? this ain't been cleaned off, y'all. This is a cheese cheese plate. That's a parent right there. I know what that is. All kinds of cheeses on there to choose from. Williams Sonoma. Made in Italy. So this might be an expensive plate here. That's what it looks like on the back. It's kind of deep. And it is made in Italy. Somebody start me out. Cheese plate or a decorative plate. Might be just for decorations. I don't know. I got a 250 bid. Somebody give me three. It is nice. What's this guy doing? Y'all get him off fire. We ain't playing with these people. Who are you talking to? That, that foreigner guy right there. Out 300. Mm. I got a $3 bid. Thank you, Jerry. $4 bid asking for five. This is a nice plate. It is from Italy. Dishwasher safe. So this is a cutting board, but you could set it up as a display piece. Mm -hmm. It's nice. It's got a little tape up here where somebody had a sticker or something on it. I've got a $4 bid from Melissa. Asking for five dollars and it's nice. All right. Jerry's kind of feeling bad tonight. I think he's hurt his back. Mm -hmm. Everybody's been asking about where Jerry's at. Said Somebody give me five dollars. They are. I can't pronounce their names. <laughs> if I can't pronounce their name, they sometimes. No, it's not a cutting board. Yeah, it could be. It's for cheese. Is that wood on top? No. You don't want to use that for cutting Why board. Why not? It's... No, it won't. <laughs> I just sold them uh, melted uh, <laughs> wine things with okay. a cheese cutter on it. Okay. <laughs> I got a $4 bed and I'm fixing to sell it. And it's from Italy. Somebody give me five dollars. Yes, it's flat on top, Melissa. It's smooth. No edges. It's flat. If you tilted it up, you cheese it slide off in the floor. <laughs> Melissa wants this. <laughs> I'm gonna sell it to you. So four dollars, Melissa. Melissa Colado. Hey guys, who who loves Tinkerbell? Look at this. You got Tink and another angel right here on a piece of glass. Look at that. She's painted on there. You can feel it. You got, hey, that's neat. You got Tinkerbell, another angel here. See? You got a little Tinkerbell right there. Somebody start me in at $5 on this. Be great. 
in any little girl's room or anyone that collects any of the Disney characters. Yeah, you're not going to be able to stay too late. Yeah, I know. And I'm not seeing a bid on it. I got two and a half from Wanda. Thank you, Wanda. I got two and a half looking for three. Two and a half looking for three. I got two and a half looking for three. Are we buffing again, James? I'm at two and a half looking for three. I'm at two and a half looking for three. I'm at two and a half looking for three. I'm at two and a half looking for three. Okay. I'm at two and a half looking for three. Sold that to Wanda Sexton for two and a half. I got a big toy coming up, guys. I need the space. It's a big item. Still in the box. Jesus. Look at this. I can't even get it all on the camera right there. There it is. Look at that. Uh, Bradley, We're gonna bang let me see. What's the word I'm thinking? Get to work. <laughs> he said he's going to be over here tonight. This what is, he's is supposed to be unloading the truck. <laughs> yeah, that is what he wants. And Yoder. Stay over playing. <laughs> okay, guys, this is a big two-sided toy house. Look at that. I opened it up. A lot of it's in packages and bags, and, some, and most of it's never been unwrapped. Be a steal. This thing is huge. It retailed. Now look at this, guys. Y'all bidding. It retailed at Coles for a hundred and ten dollars. At Coles. <laughs> and I'm only at four dollars. I'm at five. I should be at twenty or thirty on this. I'm at six from David. I'm at six looking for seven. Come on, somebody bid up here. I got one I got David in. I got ten from Wanda. 10, looking for 12 and a half. We got Wanda Sexton at 10. Got figure. Figures are, some figures are included. Uh, I got 12.50 from Donna. Somebody, somebody hit it for 20. Like I said, nowadays toys are not cheap. Average action figure costs you about ten bucks now. Ain't a whole lot of items in there. That's a sixty. I'm at twelve and a half, looking for fifteen. I'm at twelve and a half, looking for fifteen. Y'all can look them up. I'm at twelve and a half, looking for fifteen. Somebody I'm at fifteen, looking. For, somebody's gonna get a bargain, yeah, bargain, I bargain. Little kids gonna be tickled. Yeah, I'm at fifteen. Now some some little one's gonna be woo. And that ain't even put, I'm at seventeen and a half. Elevator goes up three floors. Up it's got a car. It's got doors that open and close. It has lights, sounds, and music. It does it all. I'm at seventeen and a half, looking for twenty now. I'm at seventeen and a half, looking for twenty. See, doors open, 20. signs flip. 20. I'm at 20. Maybe they started looking it up. This computer makes noise. Two side play. You can play on one side, flip it around, and you got a different scene. I'm at 20, looking for 22 and a half. I'm at 20, looking for 22 and a half. I'm at $20, looking for 22 and a half. Let's see. Bonus includes back car, 
and all three heroes. This is J. This is PJ Mask Headquarters playset. I'm at Three twenty-two and a eight. half. Looking for twenty-five. I'm at twenty-two and a half. Looking for twenty-five. I'm at twenty-two and a half. Looking for twenty-five. Twenty-two and a half. Looking for twenty-five. Twenty-two and a half. Looking for twenty-five. Could be. I'm at 2550. <coughs> I'll take it. <laughs> I'm at 2550 looking for 30. I'm selling a PJ Mask headquarters, headquarters price sticker, $110. Wow. And I'm at 22 or 25 and a half oh, right now. Buffering. I'm at 25. Are they buffering on you? Uh, I think it's just Angel. Uh, no. Okay, guys, we'll be back right back. I'm at 22 and a half or 25 and a half on it. $110 value. Wow. Sold. <laughs> Look I don't know. What time is it? Nine. 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 The third, the third. What time you got? Yeah. I'll get up before. Oh, we got to leave it for. Leanne's going to be leaving here. I'm going to be up here at six. Yeah, all right. And have Thursday. <coughs> <coughs> I just fussed around for playing around. Right. They need to be working. I've been on the telephone. Mm -hmm. Is anything over in the refrigerator? Uh, there's a two liter. Uh, there's a two liter right here. Dr. Pepper. And uh, Ricky, uh, mm. I think there's some ice in that freezer. Yeah, and they put some in there. Should be a couple over there. Here they come. Here they come back. So I was sick that up there that uh, Melissa was asking about. Yeah. <laughs> flicker, flicker, flicker. <laughs> Peanut butter probably not helping your stomach. Pretty <laughs> good wood. Come on back. Well, hold on. No, gone again. See y'all in a minute. They came back and they started buffing right back to back. We're losing them again. Are now they're coming back. There's a 43 day right here. What's going on? Quilt, yeah. And the screen keeps going black on them. They said the a lot of them said the screen goes black on them. We need to go out and come back in. It's, it's buffering again. Going. Or when you're selling something pricey, it goes out. 